be live now? Can someone confirm that? Uh, let me yeah. look on Twitch. Well, I, I uh, closed we'll everything down when my stream was running. Like, uh, uh, okay, yeah, it looks like I'm live. Yeah. Can uh, people I mean, hear me ads, okay? But... You are live und in Farbe. You are live. Is my microphone working okay on Twitch? Because sometimes it gives issues when I go live. I can hear Perfect. you. Perfect. Looks good. Siri, I okay. can see you. <clears throat> Hi. Hi, everyone. Sound heard. Okay, yes. so I will start playing Lamplight City in a few minutes with... Grundislav, Francisco Gonzalez, the creator of the game, as a guest dev commentator. But first, we are going to do a little special something with this, the infamous Einbrew. Ooh, the brew. <laughs> so, yeah, um, Truls, the Space Quest historian, has pretty much uh, popularized this, uh, this drink within our community, but I was already a fan of the, of the soda before. Um, but because of him, uh, well, because of the community, everyone uh, deciding to buy, brew, and drink it, I decided to import some as well. Uh, because beforehand, I only drank it while on holiday, where I could get it more easily. And so now I got some, and I have planned to do a little special something, uh, a cocktail. So we have this glass, a normal glass. I was actually intending to put a, uh, an ice cube in here, but I forgot. Oh, well, anyway, we're going to make the best, the very best, I promise, cocktail you can imagine. Nice. So uh, I, love, I, love the, I love how you're setting this up like a, like it's a fucking magic trick or something. It's a glass. It's a normal glass. Yes. <laughs> it is magic. Trolls, what are you talking about? Of course, it's magic. Yeah. So, yeah, in this glass, we're going to put a little bit. Uh, excuse me. Um, let me change my microphone. Uh, no, my webcam. So maybe you can see the glass as I'm putting this stuff in. Uh, bear with me. So I'm going to put in some gin. Uh, can you see the glass? Uh. I'm... Uh, Having a difficult this time. This is indeed. This is indeed um, a magic drink. Well, I'm trying. Yeah. Okay. There you can see the glass. So I'll put in a little bit of gin. We're not sponsored, although we will gladly <laughs> take I, sponsorship. I am. <laughs> I'm mesmer mesmerized, right? I really think we should go for a sponsorship. Yeah. Then we'll add some uh, citrus concentrate. Um, Ooh. Pulco is a brand name. It's just something I usually use for my gin tonic to spice it up a little. So right now we've kind of got uh, gin and tonic uh, ingredients so far. But now we're going to spice it up with some white rum. A cheap brand. Really nothing, nothing special. Um, it's just uh, cheap alcohol that you know got a I mean uh, that's just for flavor yeah the real star of the show is coming up <laughs> now we've got some iron brew in this can that I just opened as you might have heard and oh, we're funny. adding we're adding a good amount of brew <laughs> and yeah okay now to set my webcam back to normal okay so this is perhaps you might think a strange concoction, but let's give it a whirl, shall we? Drink it, drink it, drink it. Yay! Oh, that has a kick to it, but it's actually quite nice. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is great. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, actually, it does work well. I think it's got it, it's got sweet and bitter and the citrus. It's a well, I'm brewing itself has a very slight citrus flavor, I think, and this kind of punches it up. So yeah, I'm yeah. brew cocktail. Very, I think very it works. Citrus <laughs> and toothpaste flavor to it. Nah, not toothpaste. <laughs> it's it's just. Uh, well, it's it's because maybe the the they have a new formula since this year, which has aspartame, uh, part aspartame oh. and part sugar instead of just sugar, and yeah. so it, it tastes a slight bit more artificial than it used to. That might be why you think it has a toothpaste flavor. No, it's, it, I've I've seen I've seen uh, uh, 
screenshots and, and, and retweets from Scottish Twitter, which is a phenomenon all in itself, and they're just in a fucking uproar about why why Iron Brew no longer consists of like sixty percent sugar. Thirty nine percent, but yeah. What? How many? How much? It was thirty nine percent. Thirty nine to seventeen. I was I was just kidding. I was just pulling a number out of thin air. I was actually closer than I thought I would be. Or maybe it was thirty seven because I've got a Coke can here and that's thirty nine percent. I say percent. That's of your recommended daily allowance rather than the total. <laughs> What is, uh, the, what is the daily recommended allowance of brew? <laughs> uh, right now it's <coughs> 17 in terms of sugar. Yeah, it says 17%. So you could drink like uh, seven of these or, or six of these. <laughs> yeah, um, we won't recommend that. But <laughs> if you want to try it, uh, it's your choice. It's your life, of course. <laughs> Uh, we won't recommend it. We really are. Did somebody um, say Iron Brew? <laughs> no, no, you must be mistaken. <laughs> Maybe someone said Green Dislove? Iron Grew? <laughs> are we? Mm. Yes, it looks well, like uh, Green Dislove has joined. Can, oh, people, can people hear Green Dislove okay on. Uh, on the stream, because I'm still getting the audio from uh, Discord. I'm assuming it's all well, but <laughs> you know, OBS, you never know what might happen. Um, I figure if they can hear one person from Discord, they can hear all of us. Oh, yeah, yeah I suppose I'm so. I'm hoping but, uh, so, anyway. Like <laughs> maybe happens. it's the alcohol getting to my head already. <laughs> already. Well, that's, that's the bruise. It just transports straight into your bloodstream and then you know, does damage. Yeah, that's actually what the citrus stuff is for. Just gets it straight to the bloodstream. <laughs> okay, so, so what... I guess now that uh, Francisco Gonzalez, the creator of this game, is in chat, we shall actually get into the game. Um, I hope the game audio is coming through okay and it's not too loud or quiet. Uh, let me know. We'll let you know. I have no idea. <laughs> I also oh, have no. no idea. I'm just here. Let's take another ride. sip. Oh, and hello, Francisco. Good to see you again. I'm actually going to split and make a burger. Hello, a trolls. Okay. Enjoy your burger. Thank you. Uh, I just want to tell you that I love you. you oh. tiny man. Thank you, you large scarecrow <laughs> of a man. <laughs> Oh, shit. I hope you guys have a pleasant time. I will try to be back for the last hour of this, uh, but it is 8 o'clock here, and I'm off to make some dinner. So, uh, take care, and uh, love you guys. See you in an hour or so. Bye. Bye. See you, mate. Okay, so, no. Lamplight City. Um, it's a game set in a Victorian steampunk setting, I suppose. Um, and you play as a detective who, hmm, well, has some strange going on, I guess. Um, but I suppose we can get into the game and see all of that, huh? So, let's start a new game. Yeah. Okay, that was way creepier than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> what was creepy? It's, it's probably appropriate to the tone. <laughs> what was creepy? <laughs> Just, I, I got way too low with that yes. This is why I replaced it with the upside down face emoji in Discord. It was just getting weird. Bill, wake up! The carriage is on fire! It was a bit much. <laughs> That's only funny when I do it to you. Okay, I reckon the What's game the audio might be a bit on the low side. It's slow. Uh, um, it's Bollingworth Ale is all. That stuff let really me up have a look. Sorry. Oh, sorry about... Uh, Sorry I couldn't join you, but I was long overdue for a quiet night in with Addy. Is that better? That's fine. There'll be plenty of other opportunities. <laughs> Hell, maybe and Adelaide can even join funny us. Funny feeling it's, it's not coming through at all. Drank me under the table. Mm. I thought I had, it's not I coming through. Afraid she mostly sticks to mm. tea these days. Um, according to OBS, well, it's coming true. That's what we're looking into. Uh, no, OBS says a lot of things. Dozed off during the briefing. <laughs> That's uh, true. 
Uh, maybe double check with the chat, because we've had this before with the game audio not coming through on Discord. Ch but, yeah. Chat, can you please tell me whether the game audio is coming through and if the volume is okay? Uh, I just checked on the stream and it seems to be coming through okay. It's still a little quiet in comparison to us, but that's um, Okay, let's try increasing it a little more, a bit more. Uh, but it's coming out on the stream, so that's all good. Okay, I think the volume should be fine now. Let me know if it isn't. Honestly, Bill, one of these days Snelling's gonna notice. No, he won't. Why do you think they put him behind a desk? The man couldn't find his own backside with a pair of pliers and a lantern. Very funny. Anyway, yeah, it's a burglary good. at the Hambrook flower shop. A burglary, eh? How dull. Eh, at least we'll have enough time to get a drink afterwards. Alright, so officer. we're away on this thrilling I am. horse and cart ride. In fact, ride. I bet the devil <laughs> my head that we're done within the hour. And it picks up, don't worry. Oh, the devil's <clears throat> gonna be disappointed that his winnings are so meager. Yeah, it was, uh... This actually wasn't in originally. Um, uh, we've arrived. After I didn't know how to start this game, so, like, I didn't know whether to just start them off, like, getting off the carriage here, but I decided that it would be a good idea to have them kind of have a little interactive dialogue at the beginning just to kind of establish the characters and their dynamic and all that stuff. It's really, really hard to, if, uh, Thank you. like, Keep the change. get two characters that the player has never met before and kind of give you an idea of who they are and what their relationship is, especially if they've been friends forever. And so, friends forever. our night of um, excitement begins. In like you more the than span anyone of else 15 should know, minutes. rarely a dull night in Chumley. Or 30 minutes or however long it takes to exception. play through this prologue. Uh, that's a, that's always a fun box. challenge as a Keep your mind writer. on the case, Bill. Now let's get a move on. Honestly, I think I got it after, you know, that coach ride. Well, that's good. You know, you know one of them was uh, the irresponsible drinking one. <laughs> the upper one was the Boy Scout. It reminds me. Yeah, I mean, I if you want to paint them in broad strokes, that's the general idea I was Seems going like you've for, been sure. More time I mean, it's a very short running. cart ride. It goes on uh, sure. there. Jealous time. Yeah. yeah, of course. <laughs> also, uh... Come on, Bill. Well, I don't want to spoil anything for anyone who hasn't played the game, but... There was the opportunity to put in another cart ride Charming later, place, which kind of it? counter Charming, pointed that scene and was kind of like, owner. oh, well, Always so to the point things have changed. It. If ever there was a better time to stop and smell the flowers. Yeah, things do I think I'll really leave that change you, with my allergies very hardly. soon. Mm. But first we shall play this prologue. I won't be really looking at everything since we want to try and show some of the game off since it's, it's a bit lengthy. Um, so we'll try to get through the prologue as quickly as possible. So we ring this bell. Be right there. Oh, hello, gentlemen. I must say you caught me by surprise. I was preparing to close soon. May I help you find anything? The flowers in the center display are half price this week. Oh, now apparently our voices are, could be louder. today. Okay. Well, okay. voices could be louder. Um, <laughs> yeah, let me... I guess probably just turn the game audio down no need a myself, uh, I'll but, fix it in uh, a second. Uh, appreciate a little something. It's because uh, Those peonies in the corner look nice. my Windows audio settings are... I'm afraid are... we're not here as customers tonight, ma'am. We'd like to have a word with the proprietor. Give me a moment. Uh, after I this conversation, see. I'll fix I am it. Cecilia Handbrook, and this is my shop. What can I do for you, gentlemen? Good thing I'm the Detective conversations Miles in this Ford game are brief. partner, William Legere. Oh. You received a report of a burglary at your store. <laughs> a report? Very oh. brief. I never contacted the police before, <laughs> and I didn't this time. I like to be shade like that. It was made I can do it, it's my own But game. are you saying this isn't the first time it's happened? Correct. It's happened three times. But can I get into a twin wall with yourself? But considering the police hard to care about the daily muggings Perhaps. and vandalisms around here, I didn't think they would be interested in something so well, just between like trivial. a Francisco Gonzalez well, account and a we'll do all we can to help you. account. We'll have to see about yeah, that. Yeah, I can just use the two different pictures mind, that Mrs. I took. If you wouldn't mind, Mr. Sandbrook, I'd like to ask you a few questions. <laughs> Very well, detective. You from the past coming back to Yes. Okay, I'll increase this court audio a little now. Okay. I, mean, I thought you would have waited until after winter to re remove all the hair from your head. Okay. I would have if I was a more patient man. Mm. <laughs> oh, well. Unfortunately, I'm not. Well, uh, now the voices uh, from Discord should be getting loud, should be coming through louder on uh, 
Twitch and uh, YouTube on the stream. So, um, okay, let's start going through this Could conversation. Could you give me the details concerning the burglaries? About three weeks ago on Monday, I noticed that my order of Easter lilies was missing. So, uh, Francisco, I have a feeling that this game has a sort of Gabriel Knight vibe to it. Um, what would you say about the comparison? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Time, I noticed something um, no, I mean, oh. it's been, fa I think it's fairly obvious to anyone shop, who's played this game and who's played, like, the Ben Jordan the games and stuff that I really That's love the exactly first Gabriel Knight and I've been very influenced by it. And I figured that Friday, a game that was, like, you know, focused again, on detective mechanics and, and talking to people uh, would benefit from the Gabriel Knight close-up portrait aesthetic. Because, I mean, honestly, besides that game and maybe, like, behind. Innocent Until Pot, or Unusual. I can't really think of any others. I can't really think of many games where, like, the they have this sort of close-up portrait mode. Um, so I thought it would benefit the game, and it turned out to be a lot of work for me to lip-sync it because I'm crazy and I want that extra bit of polish. And also because I felt like if you're going to be staring at these characters just in isolation, if their lips just move, flapped around without lip syncing, it would be kind of weird. So, um, but yeah, uh, yeah, I totally admit that I stole the aesthetic of Gabriel Knight, but <laughs> it's fine. It's a good game. I don't think it's, well, well it's... yeah, it's pretty <laughs> similar, but it's, I think it's still unique uh, enough that uh, it's not a complete rip off or anything like that. Yeah, I didn't want to go for a complete ripoff. I just wanted to kind of go for a similar look. I mean, you know, I I always say that I don't want to pander to nostalgia, but I figured people who liked Gabriel Knight being interested in this game probably wouldn't hurt. But yeah, and mm -hmm. uh, yeah, they did have uh, they did have lip syncing in Gabriel Knight. So yeah, actually, I have to say the first time I played this game, the the bottom lip. I also I always for some reason saw it as like their their tongue sticking out slightly like <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it's, it, yeah, it just looks kind of weird to me. My <laughs> poor art skills. <laughs> just blapping all over the place. <laughs> yeah, it was kind of like that, but uh, you no, know, I think it's probably more my poor vision. Uh, <laughs> anyway, well, uh, since we just went through a conversation topic and then saw a message pop up here, case book updated with a clue, we'll leave this conversation and look at our case now. book. All right, detective. Oh, actually, we still need to talk to her more, I suppose. I thought we'd already be I have at a few points more questions for you. Where... You can also annoy her by ringing the bell. Hold <laughs> yeah, <laughs> but uh, didn't trolls do that in his stream? Uh, I don't want to copy. Did he? I, I guess he might. Yeah, I think he did. Probably. Uh, I, don't I don't want to show off all the same. Him. I don't know. Yeah. Have you found any evidence of a I don't know if it was me or. Uh, no, I mean, you get an achievement for it, so you might as well. My assistant Trevor and I are the only ones with the key. Sounds like trolls. Points of access to the building. Yeah. The upstairs is in the name. I suppose, but I make sure to keep them locked, and neither of them have been broken. Would you allow us to have a look upstairs? <sighs> is that really necessary? I was just about to close up the shop. It won't take but a moment. Fine, I suppose you may, but please don't dally too long. Okay, so now we got an objective, and we can leave this I conversation. I think that's all the information I need for now. All right, detective. So now the case book says, find a point of entry upstairs. So we'll go <coughs> through what looks to be the stairway. <laughs> Interesting choice of decor in here. Perhaps it wasn't always used as a storeroom, although I can understand why it would have been converted. Yeah, it is rather drafty in here. So in this uh, room, there's a lot of interesting stuff to look at, including this. This special device, but I'll keep that for those who play the game and will focus on the window where there seems to be a gap. There's a gap hmm. between the window and the frame here. No wonder it's so drafty in this room. Yes, yeah, lots that... of interesting objects, and none of them you can pick up. <laughs> well, the window you can match. potentially pick Securely them up, locked. you just can't look at them once you do. Hmm. Yeah. Um, I, I think you were going to say something there, but at some point I want to ask you. 
I'm going to need a tool, uh, what however. Pushed you towards that particular design decision. Oh we yeah, sure. Um, like well, I just was going to say that this was this was interesting because I noticed uh, in early testing, a lot of players didn't really notice the gap. So I had to add that tiny little bit of yellow from the windows to kind of draw your attention to yeah. it there. Yeah, so yeah that, that was does a help. Visual trick there. Um, but yeah, with regards to the whole uh, design choice to not have uh, the traditional inventory system, um, I kind of was really inspired by Blade Runner um, because that you was the same thing. You'd pick up items and stuff, but you couldn't actually look at them or use them on anything. Um, and I thought that, you know, for a detective game, that kind of made sense because it would be kind of... I don't know. I feel it would be kind of immersion breaking like if you were... Oh, Bill is nagging us for not moving. <laughs> um, <laughs> Okay. I, I, I should have exactly put in the streamer mode where he doesn't do that. But we wouldn't have this, you know, Is nice little so? anecdote, this yes. witty banter. Yeah, that's true. Um, um, anyway, detective. the point is, yeah, I didn't think that, like, inventory combination puzzles really had a place in a detective game. Like, it just seemed to me like if you're a detective and you're trying to solve a case and like there's something at the bottom of a drain for example like you're not going to make a screwdriver or a magnet on a string or whatever you're just going to get somebody to help you fix it or something like that so that's why i kind of thought yeah you know let's not do any wacky inventory stuff I, th mm -hmm. I think that's probably the most experimental that i got with this game and Personally, I, I do feel like it fits uh, not having an inventory. Well, you do have an inventory, but you can't really look at it or combine yeah, items. Yeah, I mean, it's, use it's a whatever. streamlined inventory, basically. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're not you're not rubbing items together until a plot happens. Right, you're picking up tools, and like they'll help you in throughout the the investigations at times. But it's not like oh, I have to make locked. a rubber man to disguise myself or so i don't know i, I haven't <laughs> any I see where you're coming from there and yeah. frankly I, i'm not sure there's enough people taking inspiration from the blade runner Good. game mm. it's time for our I, uh, I forget and, uh, do you get to use to exactly? clues or Simple. any items and evidence you've picked up as topics of conversation it's been a while since i've played that one the weird thing about blade runner is that yeah like the conversation mm. is very much unless like you set it to like you can set your personality, like you can set whether you're going to be a jerk or you're going to be friendly or whatever, and then there's also user choice where you get to like pick the topics, but there's no real, like the conversation system in that game is very, I don't want to say limited, but it's very basic, which is odd, and yet it still works. I mean, like there's the whole shooting component and the whole like photo analysis and stuff like that too. Well, that's mandatory, really. But, you yeah, to but it's you talk, it's interesting remember? the way that they handled nah. it. But Are you sure yeah, it was anyway, me? um, Positive. We were a few you can thank Ben Chandler for that little bit of interactivity there with the hook, because originally that wasn't there, and he was like, "You should probably make this a little bit more interactive," and I was like, "Okay, fine." So I did. Well, I feel like that's a, a, a slight puzzle element to it, so that is a pretty nice. Uh, um, so yeah, we used the tool that we found to open the window, which proves that mm -hmm. the building can be broken into. Now let's put the hook back. <laughs> I think you're we one have... of the few people that knows that this you can actually do this. Well, we have to yeah, be you kind. Be first. <laughs> Quite decent of you. You also get an achievement for doing that. Oh really? It gives I you have a few more questions for you, <laughs> yeah. Mrs. I hadn't noticed Very that. Very well, detective. If it will help you conclude your investigation faster. And it's probably bad for the stream if uh, Steam notifications aren't coming up. Mm. So that works out. Is there? I only go up there to check that the window is locked. Welcome I've back to the endless that. void. Are you suggesting <laughs> that's how the burglar is entering the store? Precisely. I believe the burglar is passing. Has my mic been unmuted this whole time? Nope. Oh, maybe. Uh, I don't know. It's been, if know you've been talking this whole time, we haven't heard you. Him. No, all they just got How back. Oh, you okay. were shuffling things around then. Maybe. You as as I know. Shit. <laughs> Don't worry, your dog didn't sneak in or anything. Yeah, it's Where's okay. the pity? 
You mentioned your assistant has the other shop. I could have sworn you I had muted myself. His name is Trevor Hastings, and he has been working for me for the past ten years. Do you trust him? No, this card works in mysterious I've ways. I've known him for ages, hmm. and he has been my full-time assistant since. <laughs> so I'm going to be releasing a commentary mode update in the next few months. Uh, so I don't want to talk too much about the stuff I'm talking like about here, but I do <laughs> want to point out that Mrs. Hanbrook Friday, was a character so that went through several rewrites because. Right He'll be bringing my it's very easy to fall into certain traps Good. about well, how to portray that. people. If like, I have this thing well, where old ladies in my I game seem really to be like shotgun toting, um, <laughs> <laughs> aggressive types. Get off my um, lawn! I think that's all yeah, the information. Yeah, I, I mean, there was a Tommy Gun, right, sweet old lady, a Tommy Gun wielding sweet old lady in a bakery well, in a Bill, golden wake, and there was a shotgun Ooh, wielding old lady hiding in a train in the shard I remember her. Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, Mrs. Hambrook, at first she was like just a generic sweet old lady. Then I was like, she needs some more personality. So I made her like a, a horny old lady. So she was like, oh. In fact, the phrase penetrate my flowery was what in there for a while. Why did you change it? Well, obvious reasons. I, but uh, I but then I decided to just I make her a little bit more just, you know, she as doesn't like the police because she lives we in a rough neighborhood and her little assaults. backstory is that we her husband was mugged and left for meantime, dead and like the police didn't come in like time so she doesn't you. trust the police and, the and flowers, she's just very much take care of herself. Also, there was temptation to make her like the Dowager Countess from Downton Abbey. <laughs> but uh, uh, but that was a little too much. Like she was a little too sarcastic. So like she's more guarded now. And then of course there's a little this subplot yeah, of like Hastings, the fact that her assistant loves her and on, it's not then. it's unrequited. This is all the crap that you write that doesn't actually make it into the game, really. What can you tell me about the recent burglaries? <laughs> well, it did kind of I make it in. Had yeah, yeah, yeah I picked up on the unrequited part. Yeah. 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 But yeah. sometimes I think she'd rather jump on a rose bush than ask for help. My youth experiences with old ladies hand. must have been very interesting for those views to stick. Not really. I just think it's funny liked. when you, you know, you have Anyhow, like sweet old know, granny and she's carrying, she's, you know, she's packing heat. That's just funny to me. No idea who Where does she keep the gun? Who knows? Or why they even bother That's paying. the fun. In her girdle. Day, if you, <laughs> yeah. place, you just you reach that certain right age way. and you master hammer space. Yeah, exactly. Even burglars don't do their jobs correctly. Do you have much experience with burglary, Mr. Hastings? Now, I never said that, detective. Have you noticed anyone or anything suspicious around here recently? Nothing but the usual roughnecks, ragamuffins, <sighs> and drunkards. Like I said, it's a real mystery. Could you walk me through the process of your deliveries? Of course. There's no great science to it. On Monday, Wednesday, and Friday afternoons, <clears throat> Cecilia gives me her list of flowers to pick up from the wholesalers. I head over to Gas Cone around sunset when they get their shipment, and I give them her order. They load up the crate, I, I Yeah, order, I like that I could I use the word back. ragamuffin. <laughs> How long does that take? I had an opportunity to throw it in there, and I took it. That's a good a word. Of hours. <laughs> it is, I agree. Usually the store no, is closed by then. So I mm. use McKinney I like to get it. in and leave the crate inside for Cecilia to open in the morning. That's or as Siri are saying, reggae muffins. Yes. <laughs> Do you ever leave I mean, the crate it's a slightly different time? thing. Hmm. No, but I'm using to say none more. I could honestly go for a muffin right now. <laughs> it might go well with your iron brew cocktail. <laughs> maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe. I'm not about to How's that cocktail sitting, by the way? Is it all good? <laughs> I'm, I'm honestly starting to feel a little already. I think it might be uh -oh. a tad strong. <laughs> oh, definitely the brew. Wiggly. <laughs> <laughs> What else could it be? Didn't mean to click that, but okay. Eh, just skip it. Blah, 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 blah. I'm an old man. I like it. I'm gonna get out of here. Goodbye. If you see me carry a crate, I'm so good at carrying crates. Oh my god. Oh, my back! Of course. Thank you again for your help. I'm Gilbert Gottfried all of a sudden. I can't. I knew we were heading back to that. I didn't want to see it. That's possible. I may have an idea. I was playing oh, Gary's mod crypto. with uh, That's always another a YouTuber sign. friend of mine on her stream so you've got a plan? and uh, a bunch talking. of her friends and somebody mentioned Gilbert got Gottfried and Aladdin and all of a sudden everybody was going, Hey Jafar! Jafar, look! Hey Jafar! <laughs> right. 
Based on what we've been told, I'm so so oh, I got a missile launcher. I can only conclude <laughs> that our burglar is using the upstairs window to get into the shop. So, what do you propose we do about it? It's happened repeatedly over the past three weeks, on one of the delivery nights. Since it has yet to occur this week, and today is Friday, logic dictates it should be tonight. So we settle in and wait to see if the I feel like returns. Bill looks like Catch that one act. English exactly. actor. It's our best chance of um, trail goes cold. The famous one I'm, I, really I can't think of his name right now. Uh, tonight too. I know. Is it Martin it's Freeman? Himself. Yeah, Martin Freeman, and that's one. <laughs> yeah, I kind of I kind of used his <laughs> portrait for Spoken reference. Like someone who perhaps should yeah. not have yeah. <laughs> I'm sure I'll get the hang of it one of these days. Especially with well, the it's not, it's, 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 it's okay, subtle, but noticeable, but I'm sure she'll be I think I mean, I Bill looks cool. See him, you, know, you don't see him enough that it would necessarily be a, an yeah, issue. Yeah. I forgot mm -hmm. to bring yeah, he didn't know he was going to get big. At least it's quiet up here. <laughs> I'm surprised we didn't go deaf after the last time we did this. What? I said he was Watson no, on right. Sherlock, wasn't he? Your sense of humor yep. remains on point. Miles, have you ever considered leaving all this behind? What, you mean quitting the force? The force, the city, going off and seeing what else is out there, you know? Ah, I'd miss it too much. I mean, it's Wouldn't not you? the classic I police stakeout, I was thinking I might visit but, Harley yeah. out west. She makes it sound like a dream. <laughs> can, like then. Wide open spaces. I do quite air. like how, for yeah, some reason, uh, Wedge Eye is moving closer to the future, or staying but contemporary, and you, you should do your it. game seems to be going Change further and further into the anyway. past. <laughs> it's much easier for you than it is for me. I've got a That's because I'm stuck in the world. past. Nah. <laughs> right. Oh, no, I, I didn't Well, with that new haircut, who just... knows? <laughs> you heard something. <laughs> but see, the irony is it's not a new haircut. It's just going back to my old Oh, no. It's, it's oh, a very God. 90s haircut, I think. I'm going back Stop. to the past. Please. Damn it. Stop police! The Stop Will all of them! On the roof? Mm. <laughs> oh, there was a exclamation. Okay. New your hat. Everyone says that. It's great. It's <laughs> foreshadowing. Bill! Uh oh! Stay back, <gasps> officer. Got a knife. Oh no! Ready your pistol for him. But you're too close. I trust you, Miles. Your pistol now. There's really no need for so this officer. So here originally I there wasn't a choice. To it would just. Turn Mine the mouse would just turn into a words. crosshair. If you let me go, and you didn't have the back. choice to reason with and the burglar. All forget but this ever I don't listen to this thought miles. that Take most people would probably click on the zeppelin. <laughs> 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 and I considered having a bit where he shoots the zeppelin and it just goes pop, <laughs> flies all over the place. But I didn't think it would put down in the game, so instead it became a, a dialogue. So like everybody just sort of blinks for five seconds and then goes right back to the scene. Yeah. That happened. What, 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 what do we do? <laughs> what do we do? What do we do? Oh my god. Can we reason with the burglar? Or should we just take the shot? Like well, you're Bill already says. having a cocktail, so you might as well have a shot on there. So. <laughs> take a shot! In your cocktail, yes. Or flip a coin. Uh, Sirayar said flip a coin. Lavasoft says shoot him. Anyone else got any suggestions? Right now it looks like we're gonna shoot. Um, Dynastic says, take the shot! <laughs> Pretty Sakar, he's real patient, yeah. He's just waiting while I'm deciding what to do here. Okay, everyone says, take the shot, so... Alright. Oh! No! No! No, Bill! Bill! Oh, God! <laughs> Bill, we hardly knew you. I'm so sorry, my friend. Well, you'll get to I'm know him. I'm so, yeah. so sorry. Okay, so we'll reload the save and try that again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not this time. You can do that on your own time when you're playing it yourself. Yeah, I think I actually tried to reason with him as long as I could. Wake up! Your house is on fire! Huh? What? You see, I told you it was funnier when I did it to so you. Sir Bill. Yes. I always wanted to shoot yes. you. I never Hilarious. loved you. <laughs> What's the matter? Have a rough night? Mm. No, oh, they, they were best friends. Terrific. <laughs> Why do I feel like I've had this conversation before? I'm just glad you're in the mood to converse again. Seriously, 
You took so much of that snake oil last night, I was starting to think you wanted me quiet for good. That was the idea. Come now, you don't really mean that. Believe me, I do. I know it's not easy, but there's really no need. Not easy? Bill, I've been hearing your voice since you died. You don't shut up unless I take that accursed medicine. I'd say that qualifies as a bit more than not easy. Yeah, well, how do you think I feel? You think I enjoy being trapped here, listening to you whine about how hard your life's become? You at least still have yours. I'm losing my grip on reality, and it's all because of you. Believe me, I know. It's not a pretty situation. But the bottom fact is, you're stuck with me. <laughs> So you can either keep I can't prevent myself from thinking Miles is Grimislav's face. Or you can do as I've told you and okay. try to figure out a way to no. let what me know. What are you know talking out. about? Yeah, Grimislav has short hair now. <laughs> Miles' uh, face, I used the Chimera right. portrait the of uh, Neil Gaiman's eyes. And yes, uh, exactly. I, I want to say, that's going to help. I, forget I can understand your confusion, considering it was but, you uh, But the point remains. It was three been different in that situation people. in the first place if not for him. Once the criminal has been <clears throat> caught and is in custody, we'll both get what we want. And no, the painting in the back is not talking. Justice. More than that, you'll have that uh, elusive it's, thing it's you always the voice wanted of to Bill. give others. Closure. The painting you is his voice. The pretty much frozen in <laughs> well, someone in the <laughs> chat was asking if the painting in the back was who That's was no talking. Excuse not to keep trying. Oh, I mean, yeah, they have very the similar voices. Mm. I'm just just wondering where this uh, clock cursor could possibly go. <laughs> just keep at it. <laughs> but where would be a place? To... Yeah, I'm making, we are. Unless, course, I'm making my next my next game is going to have a blank cursor for weight. I'm really not going to keep quiet. I know too many people, and Good I've man. done it myself too now, many times. I suggest you stop talking to thin air. Or Adelaide's gonna maybe I should have made it Bill's hat. <laughs> or just maybe... Just Ooh, I like it. Too real. Too real. Yeah. Very funny. Well, I mean, you see what happens in King's Quest uh, 6, right? Oh, sure, yeah. You put the crown on everybody. Yeah. I mean, you have to. <laughs> well, Make the cursor. You can't beat the game otherwise. Need to rejoin the living? Very much so. <laughs> Hello, clock wife. Hello, clock wife. <laughs> <laughs> you were talking in your sleep again. Did I say anything interesting? Do you ever? <laughs> you have to admit. Would that make this just counter clock wife? Oh. 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 Actually, originally the uh, after lunch the clock nap, the weight cursor was animated, down. so the uh, the I hands spun around, but hungry. Hungry. it was too distracting, you, so I, I just changed. I just left it you really should regulate your doses. I would have liked to see that. Which I can imagine it's The problem is that with the way AGS works, the animation would restart every time there was a different line of dialogue. So like it wasn't like a smooth thing if it was then maybe but yeah that doesn't sound ideal <clears throat> um okay. although that all said the first time i utilized the weight cursor it was actually as a monocle in the one-on-one -on -one conversation Anyone oh yeah want sure, to that Fordham, a big case has come in which I think will interest you. Meet me at the ruined coffee house for more details. Suck. See you often. Mm. I guess she's got a big case for me. Just so far, any come more see me. That? No, but then you know Upton. Always on a need-to-know basis. Especially Have since she's been giving me these the cases under the table. Be... To be fair, they haven't exactly <laughs> been anything be of note. interesting. Or the system she's clock. Still sticking her neck out Although I, that would be. I understand why she's so secretive about it. That'd be hard. I think she just misses having you uh, around the Usually, station. if I have clocks in games well, that Connie, reflect the actual system time, dying, it's done in real time with like the raw draw function. Anyway, so it's to meet her at the it's drawing it. Ruined coffee house. That can't uh, be right. It's yeah, I guess like in real Constance time. To make mistakes. Whereas I don't think that would work for a mouse cursor. Guess I'll head over there and see. So would that be? like a certain number of ticks since the game started and you knew what the time was rather than get the system time and Enjoy translate it i'll be back soon uh well i mean it depends on how you do it yeah if you were doing system time versus game time yeah i've never actually done in game time like in king quest 3 or uh gold rush or whatever well who really wants to add a day night cycle to 
an EGS game. Hmm. I mean, it could be possible. I'm, I'm very ignorant on EGS development, but uh, it <laughs> no, does you could seem... totally do it. It's just you, you seem to be uh, circling around the Hodgman River. Yes, uh, oh. I do love this map a lot, but the detail I personally love most is the title of this. Well, the name of this river, the Hodgman River. I went to go see John Hodgman <laughs> stand up. Uh, and then I came home and was like, I need a name for my river. Oh, I went to go see John Hodgman. Well, let's call him, let's call it the Hodgman River. There you go. That's game uh, development. I, I, I love John Hodgman. I'm a big fan of his. So for me, that's that's a real nice uh, uh, yeah. thing to put in. But uh, let's go to the coffee house. I don't think with an E, though, so I think that's... Oh, yeah. It was between that and the Last ah, Jedi River. <laughs> oh, are you kidding? I, the Last Jedi hadn't come out. At <laughs> the time I wrote this, Just make sure it was between that or like the, the I don't know. Discretion was never your Hodgman River sounds much better. Yeah. But uh -huh. yeah, his name doesn't have an E in it. Yeah. So, so here's up to I was. Uh, <laughs> I was on the subway last night, and there was these two little kids, and they were the dial. Their conversation went something like, "Ha ha! I have a funny name for you. What? Poo poo face. Ha ha! That's a funny name." And I was like, "Wow, these kids name things just like I name. Like most people." So it could have been the poo poo face river. Was it you or uh, Dave Gilbert that was starting to name their? Characters. No, it must have been Dave Gilbert. He was starting to name characters after message. things on his desk. What's going on? Oh, I Have know that he named the, the location in, Ep in Blackwell Epiphany Vantini because he saw a van outside. So stop teasing me and tell me what it is already. <laughs> but yeah, that's <laughs> the easiest way to do it. It's like, it's like the usual suspects, if anyone has not seen that. Spoilers, but <laughs> it's kind of the same She's one of idea. those Gascon Grand Dams, isn't she? That's right. I'm surprised you've heard of her. I didn't think you cared and about yes, those types of And yes, up to no people. good. I don't, but Adelaide uh, has several of his clients. She gets paid she's going to have a cute little nickname for him, too, which was something like can afford him, but Madame it didn't really <laughs> it didn't work as well, I thought. I'm ashamed to say the up to no good the service, the mourners heard a loud knocking uh, well, on well, at least you got it. She wasn't dead? Apparently not. Nearly I mean, the best I can offer is Fordham. I hardly know him. <laughs> oh, I know about the spawn. He accused okay. a man named Albert Martin, and the police Thank arrested him. So Upton also was him? originally like uh, Edward solved. Upton, I strongly and he was at the Martin police station. Especially considering and I was like, eh, let's, black magic on let's do some gender the swapping. Feel they have and so he became Constance so Upton, who was the further. clandestine helper You're from the police station. And they met at this coffee house, which is not the Napoleon house from Gabriel Knight. Hello, Sith Lord. Why not just ask <clears throat> Madame Dupre herself? She hasn't spoken since the ordeal. Apparently, I do have a Twitch channel, but I don't stream oh, that often. If you'd like to question Mr. Martin, he's being. I'm mostly here because I helped or organize you could this. Or take a look around his house. It's at 451 Comtesse Street. Did a Street fucking excellent Street. job too. And the Dupre. Oh yeah. Mm. That's at Emmeline and Comtesse. Oh yeah, and I did play Jones in the fast lane with. Uh, Trolls on his you YouTube channel. The during your investigation, since yep, I am Belgian. The case. Thanks for the warning. I'm not. Was there <laughs> wanted to talk before you get started? No, but I'm su I'm surprised that uh, the uh, that Sith Lord managed to uh, catch on to my accent. Um. Yes, actually. I oh have a no. Of questions. No, but, yeah. no, not more dialogue. No. <laughs> Let's go out of this. Thankfully, you can just and then you've her get out. back to it. Okay. So now no we can joking. start investigating well, sure how the first case of the game. Mm. But I suppose freeing an innocent man is a worthy. Uh, uh, yeah, I speak French, but it's not my native tongue. And my Dutch is well, my Dutch Dutch is my native tongue. Then my English is way better, and my French is. Passable, but not great, let's see. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's go to the Dupre Manor. You are aware this is private property, sir. I do like the little <laughs> nod that, yes, yeah, you I'm just Miles walked Ford, into somebody's home. I'm looking <laughs> the involving Madame Dupre. Yeah, that was definitely a thing that I, uh, I thought about, because I thought too many times in adventure games, arrest. it's just like, right. oh, here There's I am, okay. 
Go yeah, ahead no, and I investigate. Am. Yeah, so. I don't know if I'm afraid of the private position. I'm afraid of the position. Even though I am yeah, George Stobart. Yeah, it's nice to meet all yeah. the French Flemish people. Are Some any other board. members of the family home? Her Pretty son, much. Mr. Martin, so, yeah, I was like, well, I mean, I obviously, especially if he was going into, nerves, like, wealthy people's right homes, converse. they would probably mind, wonder what around. the hell he was doing there if they hadn't, if they weren't aware that he was supposed to be there, so. Yeah, yeah I have to give them a reason Doctor, not to call it a constabulary. Please, exactly. Oh, and thank you, Tell me about Madame Tika and Gia and the Wanderer woman and, and Chad of the Lee. Community. I cannot imagine why something like this could Yeah, I was going to say before that uh, I was really digging that bar we were in just now. With the still up on the Though table there. Though this ordeal has been terrible, mm. I am confident she will overcome Yeah, I, uh, I did take some inspiration from the Napoleon House and Gabriel Knight. Oh, you were in. But I didn't, uh, I, yeah. So a lot of people are like, oh, it looks like the Napoleon House from Gabriel Knight. I'm like, yeah, all right, fine. This actually is funny because this case was originally the second case. The, oh, uh, really? Andrew, yeah, the, the second case was originally the first, and the first was originally the second. As I was um, interested, but I, yeah, I switched them I around the because, uh, mainly because the I second case being a kidnapping case, um, it, it seemed like there's the whole subplot of like Miles is on this drug and he's not performing at his best, and like he's he gets off of it. Pretty Madame early on, to be and it seemed like a, a kidnapping was a lot more chest. urgent and Perhaps required a lot look. more mental faculties than you know a, an attempted murder, and Those so questions I've got for that now. was one of the reasons I switched I around. So <clears throat> it's funny because this case is probably the most Gabriel Knight of all of them, because like you see a lot more of stuff in Gascone, and there's like the New Orleans thing. Um, so yeah, like this is now the people people's introduction to the game. So if people play it and they play the first case, they're like, "Oh, this is like Gabriel Knight," and then <laughs> oh, hello, becomes less Gabriel Knightish as it goes on. No, I'm and then they write their entire review and based on. I did read a couple of reviews that was you know very was obvious that they had only played the first oh, case. Of course, <laughs> but, you yeah. must have sensed it with your detectives. Intuition. I'm not. I'm not saying I, I have completed everything I have reviewed. <laughs> I'd like to call myself out on that when I when that right, happens, but. Yeah, yes. I, I did I mean, finish this one. Fine. Yeah, well, it's impossible, especially if you're, you know, if you're expected to review a bunch of games. I, and there's a ton of games that require so much time. Yeah, you're not going to review and finish everything. Yeah, like an MMO. How the hell do you review that? Yeah, exactly. Or uh, on the flip side, uh, I have heard of someone who has heard of people reviewing a game by looking at the back of the box. If the good mm. doctor gave him a mind, said it I think that is like literally not enough door. time to yeah. do them all, as opposed to complete laziness. I have some questions yeah. for you. Oh, how can you possibly goody. spin something that feels like Gabriel Knight as a negative? Uh, it's not a negative. It's Madame just Dupre. a lot of you know. There's the there's the, the school of thought of oh, this it. is just this wants to be My Gabriel Knight, but it can never be Gabriel Knight She's or. Like, you know, uh, oh, it's this is just uh, a ripoff yes. or whatever. I heard you're um, the one who it's a fine Mr. line Martin to walk crime. between influence oh, no, and homage and straight up ripoff and people's perception right of that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. I would say this has influence, but well, How do you certainly you spend your days, Mr. Montgomery. What are your interests? Well, that's good. Oh, well, also, we have some. This, we have an expert that. in the chat. How do you review an MMO? You, you spend a bunch of your... time and then lots of people call you a moron. <laughs> and uh, if anyone would know what that's them. like, it's Richard Cobbett. So mm. right yes. Hello, Richard Cobbett. <laughs> no, Mr. Montgomery, most of them don't. Yes, we're here. Yeah, the MMOs. Thing. I still yeah. want to get into Elder Scrolls Online at some point. I'm trying to think what I last heard about that. Like, the that's launch was terrible and... It's still I going, like so presumably they've improved it. He has something. such pretty colors, doesn't he? That he does. You know. So people probably I recognize Abe like Goldfarb in this role. Mm-hmm. He's a pretty really unmistakable voice. Montgomery. Mm -hmm. And it was Thanks my pleasure time. to give him four of no, the most thank you weird characters in this game. This is ridiculous. <laughs> He won't be of any use in this state. I think it's a it unique voice, but it, it, of it does it fit we'll be waiting around here pretty well, I think. <clears> there yeah. was, there was one take, I don't know if you asked him, oh no, you haven't asked him because you haven't found him yet, but 
There's a there's a line where he says, "I take them when I'm feeling tired," and as they as it is in the game, it's just kind of like, "Oh, I take them when I'm feeling tired." But <laughs> one of the takes was, "I take them when I'm feeling tired." <laughs> And I was so tempted to use it, but then I was like, nah, let's not go too over the top. Here. Someone went over is it in the, the blooper reel? This brings back some it is not in the blooper it? reel. Ones I'd rather forget. You know, I'm kind of tempted to reveal Dr. the Tennyson's secret Easter egg that nobody has ever found and no one will ever find unless I tell them. Please do, because that has been driving me crazy. <laughs> but I don't know. That would know. be nice. <laughs> All right. All right. These should okay. be useful. Because it's for charity and only because it's for this stream, I will reveal a secret Easter egg for you. Is being used as Anyone who's not donated, cover your ears. Yeah. <laughs> I hope remembering what page they were on wasn't too important. Um, this is wild. Looks like it's are you guys in the random. Discord? Can you hear the audio of the game at all? Um, not at the moment, no. There might okay. be an option to hit there, but I don't know what it is. Because the Easter egg stream. is... It only works. It's only amusing if you can hear it. Oh, it's with the piano then, uh, I suppose. Um, I don't... We can, we can unmute the uh, Twitch stream, if nothing else. Yeah, I'm not okay. sure how to share the audio of the game. That's, yeah, that's Discord. probably the best way to do it. I think, right. I, think I, know, I think I know what's wrong with it, actually. Are you, um, are you streaming your OBS? Like, the uh, whole thing? Because we can see your yeah, I didn't Twitch chat and stuff, because you can't... There is an option to just um, screen share the full screen application you've got. Yeah, then but the... then, uh, well, yeah, uh, let's try that. But um, yeah, I wanted to do this a different way. Um... I mean, I'm highly tempted to say it works. Leave it alone. Um... Don't even look at it. Mm. That's a good point, though. That is a good point. Yeah. Screen share. So there should be an option up top that says something like "Apple." Hey, oh, there you go. go. Well, no, no, that's a that's a desktop window. Yeah. There, there should be an option like a tab that says "Applications," and you can select. No, it it, it only gives me the option to display the whole screen. That's uh... oh wait, application. Oh, I missed that. Okay. There oh. you go. Okay. There I didn't we see go. That. Oh, okay. There we go. Yeah. Does that work? Yeah. Okay. You're hearing the audio. Um, uh, the game, game, game. <laughs> uh, <laughs> shit. Yeah, try, try playing a note, just in case it's. No, it's quiet. it's. Well, the the the, the window is frozen. The, mm. Oh crap! Oh, oh. No, okay. Yeah, figured it. Uh, fix it. Yeah. Okay. okay. I don't hear anything though. Crap. No, neither do I. No, yeah. so, still not hearing. Damn it. Uh, oh well. Let me see, oh, do I need to turn on? Wait, volume. Uh, I increased the volume. Are you hearing it now? Nope. No. Ah, damn it. Uh, yeah, let's go back to the previous setup then. Okay. Oh, well, we tried. Yeah. yeah. All right, well, <clears throat> okay. So if you exit this screen and go out to the, uh, just want to set this up here. Oh, go so it's not hallway. a... Oh, it's here. It's just uh, just to set it up for you. Okay. So if you go outside into this screen, you'll see that there's a little porcelain figure on the. Uh, a and if it's little porcelain if you have figurine. a sharp eye, you notice it's Madame Tiberius from Shard Light. To play with dolls. <laughs> yeah. uh, and so if you go back into the room, into the uh, harpsichord room, and you play the. Uh, the first four, yeah, the first four notes from the theme of Shardlight, or the music that you hear whenever oh, you're damn. out in the overworld <laughs> in Shardlight. That's evil. Is, I nobody was gonna, you no one's gonna find it. It's da 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 da. I, let me remember what the notes are actually, because I don't remember what the notes are. I think it's. Uh, hang on, let me let me look in the source code real quick. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Even he doesn't know. I forgot. I don't remember everything. In the meantime, I'll um, drink a little more of this new cocktail okay. I made. <clears throat> oh, new cocktail? What you got now? Same stuff. <laughs> oh. Didn't you? <laughs> see? I was it's making new for today. Okay. Uh, more that's, brew. <laughs> that's not really new. Well, I mean, <laughs> same. A, a freshly filled glass full of the delicious cocktail. 
Oh god, it's in the global script. I'm never gonna find this. Um... And I can't hear the audio, so I don't know what it is. Uh, hold on. Uh... This is riveting. <laughs> I'm sure. Uh, let's see. Okay, so. Okay. Yeah, so if anyone was wondering why I thought AGS looked like some kind of dark magic. Give <laughs> <laughs> egg equals one. Okay. In the meantime, while we're waiting for him. Uh... If you haven't already, donate to Girls Make Games uh, yep. via the link on the bottom of the screen, streamlabs.com slash spacequestdestroy. We're already up to uh, 544 bucks. Yeah, and please, uh, yeah. please do Barely keep uh, the supporting us uh, by supporting Girls Make Games. Uh, <laughs> pretty much the... I pretty much thought it would be a fun idea to do a marathon as a community. Uh, and then I thought, why not make about... Uh, Adventure Games released in 2018 because, well, um, everyone knows like the, the 90s Adventure Games, but um, games nowadays, there are so many games coming out, like uh, many are lost, uh, don't have the spotlight put on them as much as they deserve, so I thought it would be a good idea to help showcase some uh, good games that came out this year and then yeah, why not also make it for charity? So that was a whole. It was idea a fantastic <laughs> idea for sure. Mm. Well, yeah, it, every it, time <laughs> we tell you that you're doing a great job organizing all of this stuff and coming up with the idea, and you're just like, "Oh no, I didn't really do anything." No, no, she did a lot. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, more than a this, lot. This whole idea is her brainchild, so I gotta thank her for it. Yes, we are mere foot soldiers <laughs> in. Charity raising army. That analogy got away from me. I'm well, sorry. <laughs> it, it couldn't have happened without I you were all of do you. Do a Braveheart speech then? <laughs> mm. It couldn't have happened without all of you. Like it was my idea, but I had to, to have people to support me. Uh, I didn't even know it was, if it was a good idea, but I got lucky enough that uh, Trolls thought it was. So here we are. Mm. Um, but yeah, um, it wasn't my choice uh, because I didn't know what charity we would support but uh girls make games is a really great charity uh they support women young women uh, who want to go into game development and game design uh they organize summer camps and all sorts of uh, events and activities to help them learn how to do all that stuff um so yeah it's it's like not something that'll solve world hum hunger or uh, poverty or whatever but it's uh, still something that's necessary because most people who work in uh, game design and development are men. So there's still a lar large disparity, uh, gender disparity in the industry. So uh, that's why I think it's definitely a worthy cause. Hmm. Yeah, exactly. And uh, if nothing else, it's, you know, close to everyone uh, who's here. It's close to our interests, certainly. Well, we yeah, that things. too, of course. <laughs> so, yeah, it may not be uh, solving world peace or curing world hunger or anything like that, but yeah, you know, it's. Yeah, pick your battles at some point. It's, it's still, still a problem, and they're still working on it, so. It's still a worthy cause, yeah, and I, I am, to be honest, very surprised that we've already managed to raise over $500, and I'm very glad for it. And I do hope we get a few more donations before uh, the end of the marathon, which it's uh, going on for, I think, uh, uh, nine more hours. So we're above halfway wow. now. Yeah. Over halfway, dang. Yeah, surprisingly Oof. already, but uh, let's keep the good guys, let's keep the good times going. Wow, I can't speak anymore, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I, found the, uh, I found the sequence you have to play. Okay. It's, yeah. <clears throat> uh, it's in the uh, towards the left okay. after after middle C it should be E G A B after middle C uh, uh yeah e so left of, left of that key there in the middle oh. yeah, E G A B E E G A B 
Uh, it should be the next day. No, it, it should, uh, it should be in ascending order, so the, just from left to right. Oh, oh, right. Yeah. All right. Now, if you go back outside, the uh, figurine should be a hand icon. Hmm. Let's see. Shake his hand. Yeah. Ooh. And now he will say <laughs> several different phrases. I'm Tiberius, and I'm a silly. <laughs> and I got Abe Gold for I was like, hey Abe, I have this really stupid idea. Could you improvise some like Barbie well, don't phrases you look for delicious. me? <laughs> I keep this mask on because I'm too pretty. <laughs> Ow! My strength. Oh, that's so good. Cane sword sold separately. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's you a great uh... like my feet is sun. <laughs> I'm Tiberius and I'm a silly baby. Oh, okay, now it's repeating. Oh, that's a great Easter egg. Oh. But uh, I don't think anyone would have found that if you hadn't just told us. <laughs> so, uh... Well, no, probably not. Delicious. I was thinking I'd probably reveal it, like, you know, 10 or 15 years from now, but this is, this is a worthy pretty. cause, I think. <laughs> Uh, World premiere, everyone. My yeah, that was awesome. I think this. I think this is worth donating for. And now, yeah. now I'm also sad that uh, Trolls wasn't here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> well, now this is something that we can lord over him. Be like, Troll, <laughs> you don't know about the Easter egg. Everybody knows about the Easter egg. Yeah, Troll. Yeah, you'll have to live the rest of your life without that knowledge. Don't wash the vod. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Uh, you were talking about a conversation earlier, I have some and questions we for might. Uh, oh, hear that oh yeah, the uh, the vigor pills. Yeah, he says the thing about feeling tired. I found this bottle looks of pills figured. upstairs. Are they mm. yours? <laughs> yes, I take those yeah. from time so to time wasn't... when I'm feeling mm. tired. You seem to be out. Hmm. Yes, that is a pity. <laughs> Where do you usually acquire them? <laughs> oh, they're available by mail order only. I'll have to remember to request some later. Thanks for your time. No, thank you for yours. Okay, um, let's look at the case book. Um, so we've already questioned a few residents. Um, what to do now? Uh, I'm not entirely sure what is like the 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 order you're supposed to do these things in, but I know one thing we can do now that'll get us a bit further. It's entirely up to you what order you do these things in. Let's have a look through these papers. Aha, what's this? So, Miss Montgomery, that's a... Uh, that's a, Andrew's sister. We haven't talked talk to her yet because she isn't in this house at the moment. But um, yeah, we just found out that she rents an apartment and we got the Interesting. key. Interesting. This Miss Montgomery must be Andrew's sister. Yay, Why let's rifle through her things show? without meeting her first. <laughs> Guess there's really only one way to find out. For a second I thought she said without beating her first. <laughs> that too. In fact, let's do everything without beating her first. <coughs> Preferably. Yeah. Hi, Miss Montgomery. Nice. <coughs> right through stuff. <laughs> oh my. Well, she does come from a rich family, so. Oh. <laughs> so oh. that's justifiable to be here? <laughs> oh. I see. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wow, get a few oh, iron brews in you and we find out you're true. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, the phrase is heat the rich, not beat the rich. Yeah, exactly. A jungle. Although, a fascinating no. array of plants in here. Hello, well, deep turn. Jim, this is Lamplight City. Daughter seems to have it's currently on sale for 15% off on Steam and GOG. Down. Sorry, I had to do a bit of self-promotion. <laughs> that's, uh, that's completely fine. Promote uh, Donate as much to charity as like. and also buy my game. <laughs> <laughs> We've all been plugging our own stuff. Don't worry about it. Yeah. 
Well, now it's this is worth it. So we haven't really heard much about Ephoricity yet, but it's a big theme in this game. Uh, uh, do you want to explain it, or shall we just uh, let the game explain it uh, on its own time? Uh, let's let the game explain it. Okay. But, it's uh, something anyway. that's there that's sort of in the background that's not really a big thing, but also is kind of there. Mm -hmm. Anyway, you can read here yeah. about some etheric effects on flora and on fauna. And interestingly, it makes plants grow larger, and it seems to make flies go into some sort of trance-like state, much like Madame Dupre was in. Hmm. Mm. Interesting, huh? Mm. Okay, so uh, with that knowledge, let's uh, go talk with Laura Dupre. Uh, no, not Laura Dupre, but her daughter. Uh, what's her name again? Uh, Juliet. 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 Is. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we don't know that yet, so uh, we actually need to talk with the people here a bit more. I thought we knew already, but... Um... Doctor, may I ask you a few questions? Please. Uh, he doesn't know, but uh, we may should I talk about... exactly what kind of sedative you gave sedative. Andrew? A simple tincture of laudanum. It's what I give all my nervous patients. He seems a bit out of sorts. Well, we wouldn't want the boy can. getting hysterical, it would can we? Have that effect, but it usually wears <laughs> off in half a day it's or fatal, so. fatal, don't you know? Is there mm, bring there's out of his tools sooner? we can use to relieve that, a though. stimulant would have the opposite effect, but I wouldn't recommend... Powered by ethericity. Could have this just became one of those on streams. Oh, of course. <laughs> I wasn't planning on doing anything of the sort. I was just curious. It's, it's clock like nose. No <laughs> <laughs> it's doc clock nose. Oh. <laughs> Wasn't that a Dick Tracy villain? Those are all the questions Imagine. I've got for now. I hope I answered them adequately. It sounds more like a Batman villain, though. Doc Clark. Opium. Hmm. Although... Okay, so maybe we can ask Andrew where his sister is. I have some questions for you. Oh, goody. I found a letter upstairs addressed to a Miss Montgomery. Who is that? You were snooping around up there. I like how he outright admits to rifling Mr. through their Fordham. stuff. <laughs> it's part of my job. Now you're going to tell me. I rifled not. through your stuff. Now answer hmm. my questions. Listen, I'm a detective. I do I this. Don't think I will. Well, he's a part you're of the detective. I'll let you solve. Are you with the police? No. Yourself. Then I don't have to you best solved with a punch in the nose. Oh, oh he actually isn't telling us. Thanks hmm. for your time. Who tells no. us again? Then? Thank oh. you for your. Uh... Perhaps your casebook will. Offer a clue. All right, of course. <laughs> we have to go talk with the accusants. Also, the game does feature. I mean, I'm not saying this to, to hurry you up or anything. I just want people to know the game does feature double click to exit, and there's also a quick. Oh. Map icon, so you don't have Fordham? to walk everywhere. Because I know people you hate like walking in adventure games. Up. Yay! Hello, Giles. <laughs> it's lovely to see you too. I like this feature. <laughs> Laudanum is ten percent opium, ninety percent iron brew. Speak with Mr. Albert Martin. This is oh, pure oh, laudanum right here. Let's him. Uh, oh. You should name the cocktail I'd laudanum. Say what needs saying oh yeah. As you can, though. He's headed for the gallows in the morning. That's a good name for it, actually. Already. Mm. What about a trial? No trial necessary when there's black magic involved. This little half breed's already sealed his fate. Such a charm. One of the main fella, reasons that uh, my previous games didn't have double click to exit was because I couldn't figure out how to program it. <laughs> Martin, and I thought, ah, it's going to take too much lawyer? time, but it actually no, was pretty I'm easy. Here to help you. <laughs> Name's Miles now that Ford, I know it's possible on AGS, I'm going to have to call out every How game that doesn't have it. Going to help yeah. me? Uh, there was one on I just did there, uh, Tango the Adventure oh, Game, where heaven. you can double click that's, to move that's faster. Music to my ears. Mm. But if you double click on an exit, it doesn't do anything. Friend, if it means place saving I am me most noose, likely I'll tell you nothing to less than God's to truth. Travel to Interesting yeah. choice of phrase for someone <clears throat> accused of using person, black person. magic. This game isn't about it at all, except the what arrow, perhaps. Yet it practically Dupre. always activates my Freddy Farkas passion. She's a twisted, because there's evil drugs? woman who got what was coming to her. Whoever attacked her deserves some except sort of reward for the me. service they're doing the community. 
I mean, it's a little bit you, removed uh, from the, no, I'm the Wild West. Mr. Fordham. You have to believe me. <laughs> by how much? Right now, Mr. Martin. Oh, it's, uh, it's pretty contemporary with the Wild West, because, I mean, the you know gold rush was in 1849, and this is in 1844, so... No, yeah, that's not far removed at all. It. No, it's then why not. why did your son accuse you? Probably because he's just as ignorant I keep forgetting how young America is. What I meant yeah. Was, how did her well, son this is Vespuccia. You? Have you had any contact <laughs> oh, with the family before? Yeah, that place. It's pretty much the same yes, thing. Yes, you could say that. Uh oh, that gleam in his eye says it all. You see, yes. I'm Vespuccia in, in the land of Dupre's uh, daughter, uh, Juliet. <laughs> but it is the land. And Dupre is doesn't like that one bit. She. It's New uh, Britannia in the state of uh, Kingsland, in the right? country of yes. Vespuccia. She might have everyone There's else some fooled. some alternate but that lore for you. It's the devil incarnate. I, I can't understand how something so heartless and cruel could have spawned someone as pure. So, uh, who actually voiced this character? Dear this was a guy named Myron really Donnelly, case much, who I had never worked with before and was cast by Shelley Chenoy, the casting director that She's I and wonderful. Dave have worked with before. And he was a really good find because he was really good. She hasn't come to see me yet, okay. but I I'm definitely sure want to work with him again. The confusion in the last few days. Juliet wouldn't believe for a second that I And then he was on uh, Love Connection I'm recently. Sure <laughs> <laughs> okay, two different things. I follow him on Twitter and I saw him tweeting like all these hashtags about like Myron and whatever the lady he was dating was. And I was like, what is this? And I looked it up and yeah, sure enough, he was on an episode of Love Connection, which surprised me because one, I didn't know Love Connection was still a thing. Oh, she actually treated it apparently a person. Yeah, and it's hosted by Andy Cohen. And uh, yeah, he was on the date. And so I was like, what I had to say is this at the same time? Is this real? Like, is this this reality like show? Like, like, real reality garden show? Garden. And he was like, yeah, we went on a date. And I was like, oh, wow, because they didn't really like each other. They said terrible things about well. each other on the show. And then <laughs> things just got better. But I mean, that's reality like TV. Don't expect you to understand yeah. or has to be together for a while before that comes out. Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, they only went on one date and they apparently didn't hit it off. Except I was a detective and she was a singer. you got to build up to that. That's how it goes. She's... Yes, Mr. Martin. Anyway, back to the matter at hand. How often is Julia? But yeah, he, he plays a, uh, every weekday. I say but I doubt three other characters. Now. She's probably trying Maybe to find four. out where I am and working um, to have me released. And Somehow, he did a great I job on all of them, I thought. I mean, yeah, it's to their credit that you can't actually tell. That's yeah. For now. If not, the, the voice of our characters, which one would be which. Mm. Okay, so now we can go talk with uh, Juliet Montgomery. And I just used to double click. Yay! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> oh, it's as though we've journeyed to the tropics. I don't know how you can stand to keep that coat on in here. Yeah, well, in all fairness, I sometimes wear my Pardon coat. The disturbance, but in are you Juliet? Inappropriate Montgomery? weather, purely oh, because it's already got all my stuff in Miles it. Miles Fordham. <laughs> I'm a private investigator looking into the events surrounding your mother's attempted murder. Pockets are. Ah. Of course. They're great. Have you got time to answer They're some good. questions? They're good. Yes, Pockets are pretty great. Problem. <laughs> well, when you're allowed you know to have them. about the events leading up <laughs> yes, to your mother's designers premature insurance? No, 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 this one does not have shock. pockets because... Mother seemed to be perfectly healthy <clears> and full of life. Because I warning, actually have no idea. She was dead. It seems to be a thing. Mm, I take it you were the closest you're to think men get to that is wearing what kilts, and even question. then you get a furry wee purse to. What sort of heartless beast would to celebrate the mother's death? Hang it your front. Oh, the furry wee purse, eh? Definitely didn't shed any tears. Furry wee purse. I admit it. Pray though, mm -hmm. that much is obvious. Miss Montgomery, you don't have to lie to me. I'm not going to assume you tried killing your mother just because you weren't upset by her death. I felt terrible. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about you there, son. Understand. I didn't you keep your iron brew you in your furry wee purse. I, <laughs> I don't know if a sporn would actually Please fit a cat. No, I probably would. Mr. Fordham, too. I've seen some it's pretty big sporns. mother and I aren't currently on the best of terms. Not... never mind. Well, the bigger the sporn, the smaller the you and your mother get along? Wait, We've never what are we talking about? Eye to eye on Nothing! Sporns. We're talking about Juliet Montgomery did. and her illicit younger, affair with Albert Martin. Yeah, we'll, we'll tell you when you're older. Oh. I saw no harm in a <laughs> kind word. Or I thought I was Australian, but dad. she warned us that if they were too <laughs> they would take liberties. 
Yeah, but there's then a time machine involved. It got weird. Mm. She really uh, went livid. That's what they're talking about. In her opinion, a university know, education was terrible. <laughs> <to achieve>. <laughs> <laughs> what sort of man would want a wife yeah, with a head full of useless facts? She'd say. I think Ikifu's Personally, still pissed that I've he missed out on the uh, trip to Uru. Quite attractive. I'm kind of fine with it. Meanwhile, the rest of us are pissed that we went on the trip to Uru. Ikifu, you keep it on your desktop to stare at it angrily, don't you? I'm not sure how she managed to find out about all of me. For when she did, she nearly had a I mean, he's Scottish. That's what they do. As I'm sure you can understand, the situation at home has been. How dare you, son? I'll chip you one. In the last few months, I'd really rather not dwell on it. You mentioned you were friends with the servants. Yes, that's right. I didn't care that they worked for us. Everyone needs a friend. Did your mother ever? Randall Trulis says, "Shove your clock in her face." No, I wouldn't say so. She was always very stern, though, and quite cold. If they ever shirked their duties or misbehaved, they were punished, of course. But so, um, nothing out of the ordinary that I ever saw. Most Mr. Of the are my Francisco Gonzalez, there is one the question maid. that's at the top Mother of my mind. Um, mm -hmm. What would you Almost say to as as I can those who have Just accused like you of had. being an, ar an artiste? <laughs> he is an artist and he knows it. <laughs> oh, 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 perfect timing! <laughs> perfect timing! I would say that those people are the greenhouse. very kind. He was working as an assistant, <laughs> oh, sweeping and cleaning answer. and catching oh. things. No, I mean, honestly, I've, I've said this before, but I feel like, I mean, I've been I making wasn't too games. In romance. In fact, for I've had a very to turn long away time. Nearly every single one of uh, and Lamplight City is the first game that I've drawn that I actually feel is like intrigued. passable and doesn't make me throw up to look at. Although there, I still like, long, like looking at it now, book or flask, I'm like, ugh, this is certain thing. I'm turning into Ben Chandler before our eyes. It wasn't too long before I had him bring me tools and equipment. Well, we're essentially the same person anyway. I see. Not too much of a difference there. Except he's a lot personalities. Do you believe yes. Mr. Martin did but anyway, yeah. fill in for awesome monster for her on a valid stream? I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> it doesn't seem like him. So the only way uh, the difference between you is to just get you both in front of Jen Patterson and say, okay, Jen, which, which is which? Blame, if anyone knows, it will be you. It. Find it your benefit. that he hated mother. <laughs> Perhaps I should have ended Wait, this which one's Benifer and which one's Jen? Although Jen's I've actually, I've, I've actually met Jen I never a couple of times, and Ben has not, this. so she well, doesn't nice actually know if he heart. exists. I guess <laughs> he has not seen <laughs> us in the same room at the same time. Oh. Do you know anything about I'm Mr. I haven't seen you in the same room at the you same time. Me, Mr. Many, a few yeah. people yeah. have. Someone of your profession would know or care about something like that. I saw photographs. Of course, those found that it pays to be open-minded. To but your he, question, is, he is a yes, massive I am familiar with the theory of a very, very kind person. In fact, Trolls, I think you're taller, though. Of their studies. I, 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 I know Despite that I'm the slightly taller, but reported, he is frighteningly tall. To and, well, in small quantities and, and more muscular, us. definitely. Have I'm like, I'm like a stick figure. He is an actually well-proportioned no, human. my research has been purely <laughs> theoretical. I don't have the means to do anything practical. I can't if, pick him up and rock him like December, you. Oh, trousers <laughs> I can pick him up, but I can't rock him. I can't understand why Juliet <laughs> can might not want to make shit. a research public. Oh. I want you to punch, bro. Not without severe back pain. <laughs> Miss Montgomery, oh, please yeah. don't lie to me. Um, I know you've been conducting just to fill you in. Uh, the there's been sort of a forest, dinner right? emergency. What? But you set the kitchen on fire. No. Again. No. Your brother told me about your experiment. How do you know about that? Uh, <laughs> exactly uh, apologies if you heard my doorbell in the background gossip. there. I'm yes, going to have to have a word with him. Anyway, I mean, I am, yeah, because there was nobody at the door. Fine. So, <laughs> seems to go off at random intervals. People just fucking... All right. I'm planning yeah, you were somebody playing chapter again. Once I make more progress. So far, I've managed to discover that plant growth has accelerated significantly. It's given me quite the advantage in class. Is that cheating? Oh, no! Oh! So, it turned into that Jones in the Fast Lane thing where over the weekend, all you meet has spoiled. My work wasn't valued in its own words by my peers or professors. I don't think you're saying it right. It should be all in lines of your... I wasn't about to lose all that. <laughs> <laughs> Idiots didn't think my best yes. was good enough. Uh, so that's uh, uh, we're uh, it, for Christmas. I got one of those uh, on the effects of ethericity French on fry maker things. Oh, like you dump them in, you add a little teaspoon of, uh, of the cooking oil, and then it spins around for forty-five minutes. Those oh, like the air fry? To satisfy yeah. Uh, I, I, uh, it's, oh, it's called an active fry, so I call it my Philip J. Curiosity. 
Seems like a and lot of effort to go through. It's, just to yeah, that was grown into wasn't it? Then I never really understood the scientific type. So now we have cut apart many potatoes, and no more we questions have filled this thing up then with you don't mind, regular potato, salt and pepper. Yes, and we used the spare potatoes to throw in the oven and add all sorts of spicy bullshit. So now we will see which potato does best. And that mm. was the story of my dinner city. Now, <laughs> the point is, it won't be done for another 20 minutes or so, and then it is eating time. So I might not be here when the stream ends and when uh, poor old Alexander uh, starts Saint his. Dennis Cemetery. Well, I was Best dying to see city. what he was up to. But, Just a shame uh, none of the residents know, can enjoy it. In good it. conscience. I think I'm I buried around here somewhere. That I still what are the old gravestones so. doing these days? Well, uh, okay. yeah. you just missed the secret Easter egg. Yeah, it's revealed. Fine. I don't know why. Oh, it's, shush, a recent uh, the force. it's fine. Well, at least you won't recognize it. <laughs> he didn't say Easter egg. He said Schmister. That was his dinner. It, it doesn't come no. highly recommended. <laughs> my, my dinner talks, and, and most place? people, most people just come for dinner that, once sir. and then stay away. Tomb is currently part well, if your dinner talks, it ends really spoiled. And ain't available for visits <laughs> until further notice. Don't cook me. Excuse me, sorry. sorry. Or it's still alive. Come to think of it, I probably not. have a potato in the cupboard that I'll either need to throw I out or give him flowers. <laughs> I'm sorry, in there a while. sir, but Buddy, I've got my orders. Let's name him Henry. Come back in a few days. I can assure you. I'll just write that on the side of the potato. Anywhere. <laughs> Two googly eyes and a face, and then my name is Henry on the side. So a quick, uh, uh, a quick Sorry. little behind the scenes thing related to how an artiste, how much of a terrible artiste I am. If you notice this background, you see the sun is setting or is, oh. is low in the sky there. And uh, yeah, so the way the background is set up, the sun is low in the sky. If you look at the view, it talks about how you can see the other burrow across the river, right? Nice view so from up here. <clears throat> if you go back to the map, the cloud of smog over the chum. Um, originally, the uh, cemetery, the way I had drawn the map, was the cemetery was at the bottom of the map uh. towards facing the ocean. And I was like, damn, geographically, this doesn't make any sense because the sun is not in the right direction and people will notice and it's nowhere near the river. So I had to move it to where it is now. And when I explained this to certain artists, they said, no one would have noticed. And I said, yes, they would have. <laughs> so I, I don't think anyone would have noticed. <laughs> well, yeah, raise my hand here. Well, Would I know. notice uh, now because you just said so. <laughs> now, <Yeah>. yes. <laughs> it's like yeah. my philosophy. I would have noticed so. Originally, it was you see that little like bit there, right to the right of Madame Dupre's icon, where there's like the the like green patch with the four, five dots in it, and there, that's where oh, it used. Yeah. Hmm, so I yeah. had to move it to the top left. So this is so a park they're... now, or something like that? Yeah, it's a park or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it, that's the unofficial cemetery. Yeah, and the other park thing, which is not a park thing, is now a huge network of catacombs. Yes. I like it. I will not be able to unsee this for the rest of my life. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> looking at the casebook, we've questioned the residents of Dupre Manor. We've tried to <coughs> investigate a Chesterton tomb. And while um, we haven't been able to find a stimulant yet to bring Andrew, Andrew out of his stupor, so this might be a good time to go back to the coffee house and review the case with Upton. He's just there all day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, somehow. Can we talk? She has no life. <laughs> she she, she works at the police in. station. She got herself in. She's not leaving. I wanted to go over the case with you. Okay, what have you got? What do you know about Madame Dupre? Only what I've read about her in the paper. She's been married thrice, which I can empathize with, and she's extremely rich. I mean, God damn it, this is her lunch break, and she well, is think this Martin intent fellow is enjoying it. It's her day off. The fact that the only yeah. evidence oh, it's is her day off. Okay. Yeah. And that makes sense. I've seen this sort of thing she says that she's times, and I'm spending sure her day too. off in there if you ask her about herself. A scapegoat. Oh, she took a whole day off to enjoy her lunch break in there. That's how committed to it she is. Honestly, because of this cocktail, I am now craving cheese. Oh, boy. 
Oh, oh. is it, oh. it, it good? Is it still good? There's an officer posted at Dupre's family tomb. Side you know effect of this cocktail name. Makes sense. Who's the officer? I don't know. She was she was talking about beating rich people earlier, so. He's young. Yeah, you know. That's just a side effect of Iron Brew in the first place. It's the working man. He's only been with the Dupre. Screw you, bougies. I don't know how to <laughs> with the, him, but with he's already got the reputation for being the type of policeman who'd go out of his way to help old ladies cross the street. Stream. Typical goes southern gentleman, it seems. <laughs> I'm not sure whether that should be hyphenated or just uh, stuck together. Definitely the needs to be son isn't being very helpful. The Adventures of Sunboy and Squid Lab. <laughs> like oh, that's the doctor has him pretty well drunk to the gills. <laughs> so I need to find some yeah. way to perk him Some up. boy hyphenated well, squid lad stuck together. In a coffee house. Oh, oh yeah. I have a feeling it will take squid lad. Touch um, it says that's misspelled, but I'm just gonna roll about the case for now. <laughs> what does it know? Okay. <laughs> State of that's mind. it, I think. Sorry, I, sh I should mute my then microphone. You'd better get back to uh, it. You guys uh, play a game. Thanks, we will. Dad. <laughs> <laughs> now we have two dads. Does Upton just spend all day at the coffee shop? She does for case one and case two, but then she goes elsewhere <laughs> throughout the rest of the game. Well, she it, it turns out she actually has a residence, and uh, she does. I'm the here. Tiny little the little just made it back in one piece. Went, oh, oh, maybe so we should show that she's not just Upton's a permanent got fixture of that another <laughs> missing dilapidated pet? coffee house. If only. Yeah. She's well, I mean, Gascon Grand Dam was attacked. She also. You she also Madame goes Dupre, back to work. The one whose obituary was in the when I was first designing Very this, same. I was thinking about Goodness. like one of that the things that serious. could happen, or one of Tell the things I could implement I was I know uh, you been feeling your like best. you're told, oh, you should you're go meet so and so. Me, They'll be here well, sure at this time. Well but I certainly hope if so. you didn't, if you took too long, or if you didn't go at the same time, like they wouldn't be there, and you would have missed them. And I, yes, dear. Dark seed thing. <laughs> yeah, I thought that would be a little frustrating, and also like, I, I mean, I like the idea I of. If you could do me a favor. The, in theory, I like There's the idea of like the whole virtual theater, too. like in Lord of the Temptress inside. and stuff, where characters are kind of wandering around doing their own thing. But my it gets really annoying charm. when it's like, oh, I have to find this well, character. Where are they? And then they're not where you think they're supposed to be. The flip side of that is, yeah, then you have characters that hang out at one location. Should for we really be tricking a comical a amount of time. Like that? <laughs> but no you kind of, I don't know, you, I, I played with, I mean, I tried playing with that with like, yeah, Upton moves around different right. places throughout the cases and like Adelaide is at home, but then she goes and has her own life after she helps you here, for example. Excuse me, yeah, but it's, it's trigger based instead of, uh, yeah, exactly, room. instead of real time based or whatever. I'll be One sure of the things that irk me about the last express. Mm. Yeah, and Gabriel Knight 3 did it to an extent as well, where it would, would I mean, it would let you know with a giant TikTok noise, but that's when you knew yes, that like characters that, had shifted but I around. Seem to just be going in circles. Perhaps I'm trying to remember the, the right details direction? of the uh, Laura Bow implementation. Right that's quite mm -hmm. enough from you. I beg your pardon. And I don't think I can't tell what your game is. Uh, you're trying to lure me away from here and into some alley where your gang of sambos uh, is gonna rob me blind. Exactly how many of them have you got lying in wait for poor unsuspecting fools you bring them? Just one. <laughs> and he doesn't uh, appreciate Discord voice chat is some having some issues. You know, Sometimes I yeah. yeah. oh. I had to, I had to leave and, and, and rejoin. It seems to be Miles. fine now. Was that yeah, really everyone, necessary? Everyone was doing a I'm sorry, Eddie. You yeah, know it's how back to the minds of rubbish. <laughs> Let's just get him out of sight before this lands both of us. It sounded jail. awesome, don't get that me wrong. I wish I sampled it. But there was a hiccup there. Um, but yeah, Laura Bo, uh, say, I wasn't expecting after a certain amount of time, yeah, the clock would move forward and then list. everybody would shift around fine. as well. When you're on but, the force yeah. as long as I was, was pretty good you must get away with murder. Yeah. yeah. Although I, uh, I love Laura Bo. Probably Richard also that. brought up uh, KGB. Well, it's, it's another example of a game fun, that did that. Or conspiracy, depending on your region. A few of Try to stay out of trouble. Was it Donald Sutherland? Sounds right. You know what? I've got it over there. One second. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, working at a graveyard seems like a good job. Like, you don't have a lot of responsibility since all the people you're dealing with are already dead. I don't know. I hear it's a pretty dead end job. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's dead end, but also <laughs> low, low responsibility. Yeah. 
Mm. Uh, but you know, it, it can get quite grave. Uh... <laughs> oh, the puns. Bum, 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 bum. So, we finally made it to the wide open. Yeah, you made it into the tomb, hooray! <laughs> I'm rather surprised no one has defaced it. Hey, grave it. robbing! You don't suppose yes. this is... Yes, and this, it, this there was a letter that we found earlier that said about finding the surprise, secret pills surprise, under the surprise, Weeping Angel. The Not the, the Weeping Angels from inside. Doctor Who, but Seems Mr. this one. Has a little business this angel is more than just weeping, it's just going, Why, God, why, fuck it! Yeah. This, yeah. this is an angel that has given up on everything. Yeah, it's a Pretty very much. dramatic angel. Lethargic Maybe it's just really angel. tired. <laughs> so, so we just found the homemade bigger pills. Yet it still, yes. still says which, find a simulant. Hmm. Which are oh yeah, that pills that clears That's... once you actually bring Andrew out of his stupor. Oh yeah, but uh, yeah. <laughs> it should it should have maybe changed to bring the bring Andrew yeah. out of his stupor. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> maybe. <somewhere. laughs> but it's okay. Um, so yeah, let's go do that. Yep, so we found some Ekkies in a tomb, and we're going to give it to some random guy. That's fine. <laughs> I mean, we're not the police. I we can do whatever we want. We're a private oh, citizen. Oh, goody. <laughs> I think there's this. still some laws against that. Maybe not at this time, but... You yeah. wouldn't believe what I found in your family's tomb. I just love his dopey oh, uh, was it demeanor. A ghost? Just, it, like, his, his, his jaw is so <laughs> projected No, it was forward. these bigger pills. Just has this you wouldn't have to know how they got there, like would you? Be talking like this. I see. You I think really his jaw is held on by those sideburns at this point. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. Look, Andrew, I'm straps. in no mood for games. <laughs> it's the only thing holding his scalp in place. Just be quiet and take one of these pills. I suppose one would help. Thank you. And we're about to give him a heart attack. Spoiler my alert, the brother has actually been decapitated. I forget how <laughs> those pills work. My heart is racing. He said you had questions, didn't you? Well, go on, ask them already. You mustn't waste any How's more that time. Doing? Well, that seems to have done the trick. Good. I just hope we haven't doomed him to a heart attack. She's gone quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Can't you Can so she you're running some kind of pill business She might need a refill. Side. Uh, I'm providing a service, You don't want to overdo Mr. the brew, Fordham. trust me, that's what we did uh, isn't on Christmas lucky Eve. As I am. That was a bit too much People pay top crowd for luxuries See, the good like thing about Oh, I missed that stream, I need to watch that. Club memberships. Uh, it's Medicine not public. should be affordable too. Yes, oh. it should make Dr. it to a lot. What about for friends and family? On the market. That means he can charge <laughs> and people that follow your Twitch, surely that's already Students use these kinds of pills all the time, you know. Academic rigors can be overwhelming, and concentrating but we can also without help Let's sometimes. That's fine, we can tune away. I've got no. the skills. Video is 128. If I can replicate the formula, is... help my fellow students ah. and sell them at a much more reasonable mm. price. Right, I'll, I'll Why put it shouldn't in the, uh... Furious bridge humping? That That's an old one. <laughs> oh, you're starting to sound just like Oh, but it, it has, it actually has my favorite quote of yours. just because it's illegal doesn't mean it's immoral. I can think of plenty of examples where the That age-old chestnut and spin it. You're probably the most altruistic person I've met all month. <laughs> oh, right. The sad part is, it's true. <clears throat> it's just the way you delivered it. it what can you tell me about Madame Dupre? Oh, look at the look I at that nice kissy would be so face. Cruel as to do with that Torpedo bear looks like he's going to explode. Mother is kind and <laughs> generous, and everyone the, loves her. Uh, She's even good enough to hire on actual people to do the housework. Oh, nice. Not many wealthy families do that, yeah, you know, sure, they just I'll, use automated I'll, machines no, I'm, I'm hesitant hire to servants the, to operate the, the manual I'll make it once. public soon, don't worry. Mm. I've just uh, noticed one of his eyebrows has gone exactly up since he got that stimulant. Up to your <laughs> <laughs> well, his <laughs> eyes, his <laughs> eyes opened ago, up wider, too. Home from school and found it's her subtle, but I tried to make him not look too goofy when he was young. She wasn't breathing, so I immediately contacted Dr. Fellows. He does have kind of a, eh, look. We were all the jaw's still messed up because, well, devastated. that's just me being, I'm not an artist, health. as we Fact, all know, so. Been out that she is just a, a You can imagine our surprise at the suit. funeral when she mm. sprang back and to life. And besides, we know you are an artist. Yes. Right. Totally different. Huh. What can you tell me about your sister, Juliet? Ah, uh, Juliet, smart as a whip and just as forgiving. So has she's anyone checked that if uh, Summer's microphone Despite is Despite being the only woman no. in her class, she's managed okay. to rank just, at the top. She was just ignoring you, Impressive. like yes. smart people I do. Wish <laughs> ah, I didn't know I had to respond Juliet to anything. Uh, to oh, no, not at all. I was, <laughs> boring family I was just 
uh, going through the oh, game the <laughs> and thinking about it. It's so reassuring See, to know she was just doing the thing we're here to do. <laughs> yeah, and, and doing doing the thing that I absolutely neglected to do in my uh, playthrough of this game, paying just, attention. Uh... Well, you weren't deliberately trying to fail. What's your relationship with the servants like? Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> relationship? And you had help in uh, with them. They're servants. Uh, figuring out the <laughs> precise, <laughs> correct way to fail. Part of the quote, unquote, help. help. We've only I got two on staff fail. right now, though. The kitchen that. girl and the gardener. There's actually a bug that someone just found Thanks for that your time. I realized My was there pleasure? in this case that makes it actually impossible to complete. Whoops. But Game it's breaker? only if you do, a, <laughs> do things in a very specific order. So, mm -hmm. like, fail to succeed in the case, or fail to finish it at all? Both. Like, it Ooh. it basically leads you in the Walking Dead situation, which I very much was like, there's none of those in this game! So people are like, what? This game is terrible! And one person left a bad review on Steam, because they were like, I got stuck! I'm like, I wish you had told me that before <laughs> writing your review, so I could have looked into it and fixed it. But, yeah, I'm going to be fixing that, updating that soon. That's uh, good. Well, that's so, so what is it you're not supposed to do? I mean, you can, again, you can tell, but by the time Mine people... So, okay, so you know uh, the accused mother. You yeah. can go to her house and you can... There's the whole thing where you can look behind the curtain. Yeah. So, yeah. the the way that the game works is there's... It's tracking different variables. So, so you, study botany. you have Fascinating different subject. ones for each particular Are lead. You so like plants, you, Mr. once you get a certain number of clues the the that increases the, the variable to a certain number for a particular lead, plants that's what triggers the Just like people in many ways. bill saying, oh, this person's mean? a suspect, and uh, that, that's when they, they get care. added to your case, but whatever. Same thing for the failure states. So like, if you, you know, if you Plants have have, to have said to Andrew, and like, oh, the, I'm going to report you to the police, and he gets pissed off and doesn't talk to you anymore. That, you is, that increases Andrew, the failure case one state. So when you, you go to him, talk to no uh, Mrs. Martin, to him on there's two fire. ways that that but encounter can really end if you, if you pursue it to its full potential, which is either you look behind the curtain, you ask her about it, she gets mad at you and throws you out, which then increases the ability to accuse Albert Martin because it's considered suspicious that she's so cagey about the stuff. Yeah. And then the other thing is you ask her to the failure state, which is you, you ask her to go get the tea. She goes to get the tea. You don't look behind the curtain. You leave instead. And then you don't get that chance anymore. So you've, you're not able to pursue that lead any further. So the case yeah. becomes unsolvable, right? Or at least the, the failure case goes up. What I neglected to remember was that when you ask her about the backroom stuff, you have the option to press further or drop the subject. And if you drop the subject, nothing happens. So I forgot to set the flag to say that if you drop the subject and that's it, then that should increase the failure case one state because that lead is now closed off, but I didn't. So if you talk to her and you drop the subject and you piss everybody off, you don't have that last thing to make the case, the trigger for the case to uh, being unsolvable to go off. So it then becomes a Walking Dead situation. Whoops. Uh, Whoops. Uh, can happen. <laughs> can Whoops. happen. Indeed. One yeah, line. but thankfully somebody found it and I was able to fix it with literally one line of code. Yeah. <laughs> well, Sorry. I am going to scoot off and eat a bunch of french fries. Uh, before you go. Let's see uh -oh. what's here on the yeah, stove. Like the on the menu uh, <laughs> it compares with Upton's special. Mm. <laughs> well, it's close enough, isn't it? It's uh. Soup's on. Come on. Soup's on. on. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> no! Yes. Was the volume okay? <laughs> yes. Oh my god. Uh, okay. I didn't yeah. expect it to be full screen. <laughs> that was amazing. I should make soup tomorrow. <laughs> Pardon me, miss. Next time I make soup, I'll be sure to tweet a picture of it with uh, Miles Ford skull face I'm investigating in it and... the attempted murder of yeah. Madame. You know the the oh, baby so that's kidnapped so. in the next case is named Charles. I can't help you. Mm. Oh. Charles. You so could chuck, chuck him into him the soup. Into soup. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh God. Stop oh God. Stop it, Ryan. Uh, that was that was worth it. Yes, I, I shall now be eating French fries. Have a good one. And my apologies to Alexander if I'm not there at the start of his stream. Um. Hey, Juliet, take good care of my boy. Miss Juliet. All right. 
It's like, kind of yes. I spoke to her at the university. Uh, yes, she always a pleasure, Mr. Friends. Gonzalez. Yes, Our true artist that's right. <laughs> She's always mm -hmm. been so good to me. Yes. Look, see you guys later. I'm just Bye. trying to get to be back soon. Right be back soon. I have a feeling you can be very helpful if you just let me talk to you. All right. Fine. So how in but character would it have been to just add an option for every case to go up to Upton and say, fuck it, I give up? <laughs> the funny thing is that originally that was the option. Like you could you could just declare the case unsolvable from the start. What do you know about Juliet? But I realized <laughs> that like, yeah, that, that'd be kind of stupid if you just speed run the game like by just, as soon as you leave, you come back Still, and you're like, oh no, that's it. So then I changed it so that you had to... Nights. Um, Even though she's a good you soul, had to screw up everything. Of her does it but then a couple of, 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 well, several people were like, I don't like accusing the person I know is clearly innocent, and I screwed up the right lead. Tell me so I was like, all right, well, then I'll let you, you oh, I'll really allow you to sir. declare the case unsolvable as soon as the suspect is unlocked. So I, I patched that in uh, about a month or so ago. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. I do. I do yeah. enjoy that that ah, the the game has fail states and multiple endings, me. and you can just do good or do so bad instead of just having one true way work. through the story. But madam, yeah, it can be difficult. Now, if there were a phrase to difficult. describe this philosophy, what, do you, mean by that? Uh, what, what <laughs> would you say? No, I said enough. That, 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 that would be. It's permitted to not do well. <laughs> you know about that's, that's the one. Death. Maybe uh, maybe I, I should tighten it up a bit, a bit better and say that maybe it's okay to her. fail. Do you know? Albert yeah, while well, you were put on the spot there, the so. yeah, yeah. it is permissible to fuck up. <laughs> there you go. What can you tell me about? That's Andy? our motto for the stream, isn't he ain't it? So bad. Yeah. <laughs> spoiled, but he mostly cleans up after himself. Has a oh whole man, Hopkins of the house. But I think he only uses one. Life White City Edition. Not Extra gore. Way less and uh, <laughs> traced over George Stobart walk cycles. Are you the only remaining servant here? No, so that's what you meant by Wood to Well, Hopkins one. FBI <laughs> actually <laughs> literally days, like painted over before. George. Oh, Stobart. God, really? Yes. Thank you, Connolly. <laughs> if you look at it, you can totally recognize You're At least not. I was able now, to recognize please, it. Please, let I, me get back to work. It's fairly obvious. Oh. Dear. We've missed a trigger, it seems. And oh, and I'm also nowhere. Doom Sprites, according to Richard. <laughs> okay. Um, <clears throat> I think he was telling me about this. Yeah. Oh, you have to. Uh, yeah, you gotta. Are you, uh, you talking about Jean? Yeah. yeah but uh, you we have my... Juliet. Oh, Juliet. Uh, I thought a doctor maybe. But uh, uh, yeah, okay. No. I mean, you can ask the doctor about him, but he's just kind of like he's an asshole. Well, I thought first we had to talk with the doctor, doctor to like yeah, know about questions. him, and then please be my guest. Could, uh, oh, ask oh no, you have to ask uh, Andrew about him. I oh, I guess I did already. Yeah, I think you. Um, okay, then let's. Uh, well, I thought I had already. He's busy. Uh, no, no, no. Oh wait, maybe not. <laughs> okay, let's see then. Uh, Let's hope we didn't <laughs> come into a dead man walking situation also. Um, <laughs> oh boy, no, let's hope we don't. Let's uh, talk with Andrew again. No, if you ask Andrew ask about himself, he oh, tells right. you about... Uh, oh, okay, it's a few... Yeah. How do you there typically spend your days, I didn't know Montgomery? that we had to interests? ask him about himself. I study pharmacology at the university. I'll be graduating next year if all goes well. I just hope Mother has recovered enough by then to understand what's going on. She and Jean were so proud of me when I started university. Okay, I'd yeah. be so disappointed if she couldn't see me finish. And I can ask about Jean. I take it Jean is your fuck stepfather. Is Jean? He <laughs> is. Mother I should have added like grizzled years detective. After my mode. father died of consumption. <laughs> my condolences. Do you have a good relationship with him? Not terribly. Truth is, I hardly ever see him. In fact, before the funeral, I think you have to play like EGAV. We did that already. Shh, it's a secret. I don't know for sure. Doesn't leave this but chat room. But it seems likely he's in his hunting cabin. Don't tell the space quest his story. Hunting cabin. Yes. Yeah. He often goes Unless there. Jagger it's J his way is of like leaving polite society behind. behind and spend <laughs> time with his thoughts. It is possible. Yeah. Yeah. He is on a really bad internet. Well, I guess that's where he's gone. I know. To be still... honest, I don't know Summer why I'm here uh, with Mother in her time of yeah, need. Uh, Gemini, please don't swear. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do you know where this cabin is? Are we doing a <laughs> giveaway on the stream? I don't share his uh, yeah, we'll be doing a giveaway at the end of the stream, which is coming up fairly soon, I suppose. 
we've only got 20 minutes left and I'll... Oh, oh yeah, we, we, um, we did want to show off something special as well, so I guess this will be... Oh, really boy. Yeah, uh, I guess we'll have to end the playthrough here. Actually, um, I think you might be close enough. You can probably accuse Juliet. If you oh, want to really? like wrap things up. <laughs> oh, yeah, let's, you've let's... already asked her about her ethericity. <laughs> Let, let's give that um, a roll. If you go talk to yeah, if you go talk to her and you go to the cabin and you find the letter, that I think that's more or less all you need to be able to accuse okay. her. Yeah. Let's uh, do that <clears throat> and then uh, we'll show this Hello, special guys. little something for a little Fine, bit and then we'll do the questions. giveaway. Hello, Mr. Fordham. Oh boy. Not at all. Okay. Is there so... anything you can tell me about your stepfather, Jean? Jean? He's a kind man. I don't really see him too often. He seemed rather upset <laughs> 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 but I can't help but wonder if he feels Pretty the same way do about her death. What do you mean? Oh, oh, I want a gun and your badge on my desk by morning. They'd like it to I'm sorry, sir, I didn't solve uh, the case. I'm starting to sense a trend here. <laughs> your brother told me that John enjoys hunting. Do you know where his cabin is? Yes, it's in Fenton Swamp. I went out there with him a few times, but I didn't really enjoy it. Okay, anyway, let's skip you. through it a bit. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, we know he's a fan in Swamp. <laughs> okay, so yeah, now we can go I'm to the bored cabin. now, shut up. <laughs> Hello? Is anyone here? Strange, if you're afraid to leave the door. Nope. Let's see if Jean has anything interesting in here. Not very much, except the letter. Dear Jean, thank you so much for your help. To think that Mother would try and have me with John for my studies is just unbelievable. Don't worry, I won't tell her you made the university change your minds. One attempt to ruin us a life is quite enough, Julian. <laughs> All right, now you can go back and ask. That's Gilbert Godfrey trying to do. Seems separate. like enough ev evidence. Yeah, mm. uh, must must be Juliet. Yeah, uh, can't, can't argue with the facts. Uh, you have to ask Juliet about it. Oh, and then she'll she'll con corroborate the fact that she was upset about it, and then yeah, and that should be the trigger. <clears throat> Hello again, Miss Montgomery. Mind answering a few? More? Hello, Mr. Fordham. Did your mother try to get you withdrawn from the university? As a matter of fact, she did. Just another one of the many ways she tried interfering with my life. What happened? So Yara says mother that sexy voice from the people who I read Julia's letter. I Flair. couldn't believe it at first. <laughs> I thought it was something... So, Yara think thinks you're a choir. More than upset, mm. Mr. Fordham. I was furious. She was furious! I was trying to make a real life for myself. <coughs> oh, she, obviously, she did it. Or debutante balls or fending... I've been given the chance to make something of myself. More poison? Oh my day! All crashing down, just because she didn't agree. With but in the end, you're, you're still here. Home. Yes, Jean stepped in and fixed everything. He good didn't old have to Jean. Do it, but it was very good of him. I'm afraid that was the beginning of the end of my relationship with Mother. Unrelated? Would you like a cup of definitely <laughs> no not poisoned tea? Then if you don't mind, <laughs> it's my favorite I type, Richard. Do. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, wait, no, I guess there's something else. All right, wait, go talk to Albert Martin. Again. <laughs> <laughs> and... R.I.P. in pieces, I Gemini. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, Albert, hatred of Dupre. Madame Dupre. The woman is cruel, sadistic, and bigoted. When she found out about my relationship with Juliet, oh, she, she sent me a... So yes, Mr. Ford, but even so, I love her daughter. Jagger G says my internet isn't that Juliet terrible as well. Wrong at all. I don't know. What are you seeing right now? Yeah. There was something going on. <laughs> Intriguing. Are you even seeing Lamplight City at the moment? That's all for now. <laughs> I can taste few shots. Are you thinking? Nope, there you go. Thinking? Wait, what am I saying? Of course you are. Madame Dupre has been interfering with Juliet's studies and disapproved of her relationship with Martin. Hence, they're falling out. Plus the information in Juliet's notes. I think Richard's got his mind in the times of uh, uh, where this game is set. Listen, we've talked to the other suspects, and they're all Richard. And and motive, so that's plenty to consider her a suspect. <laughs> okay, so we've got right. suspects, and she's going down. 
<laughs> well, we ran out of are time, you... and all the evidence points towards her. So, are you? Uh, you're playing on Steam, right? I'm playing on GRG. Oh, well then, does GOG make you manually update, or does it do it automatically? I'm curious now to see if, if it's not a... Galaxy, um, then uh, it'll be It does do it automatically. Oh, I'm listening. I am on the latest version, uh, as okay. far as I know. Then you should be able to declare the case unsolvable as well yeah. as falsely or accuse Juliet. Okay. Yeah, I had already seen when I was playing it a few days ago that I could make oh, it. Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. it works. But uh, let's uh, Juliet, let's say Juliet. Madame Dupre is a strange daughter. Oh, Juliet. The dice was loaded from disc, the disc. Mm. Madame Dupre disapproved of Juliet's relationship with Mr. Martin, and also tried to have her withdrawn from university. Juliet grew to hate her, and wanted to be free of her overbearing and controlling influence. Also, Upton, so enjoy these sketches that I've made. <laughs> Aside from studying botany, Juliet I mean, they had to come interested in ethereism. Like He's like a cool fellow, like Leech, just drawing them real quick and very crappily. Notes, she, she does amazingly quick portraits or sketches of trance. <laughs> yeah, this conversation actually takes like four nice minutes. Him. I'll pass along the information and we can make an arrest. And then, when they had an <laughs> argument, I uh, hold Mr. on. Martin. You got another <laughs> pencil. And of course, I'll dip into the department's Good Samaritan fund to get you proper compensation for your work. That's why court cases now, took so long back then. Your wife. Mm. I'm sure I'll have to get compensation fairly soon. soon. Evidence. Shit. Hang on. I just pictured him making Juliet one of those Montgomery? like flip books, you know, when you draw yes. the. <laughs> <laughs> the You're under arrest for the attempted murder of Madame Laura Dupre. What? But how can that be? Uh, this Come is a reference me, I think Montgomery. nobody will get, but. You um, it's a Scottish sketch show called Chewing the Fat, and they had a regular Maddie, segment I'm home. Uh, reporting from outside of Kirkcaldy Sheriff Court where various weird anymore. things would happen. I'm glad and one of them was uh, the courtroom artist getting punched out. Something. Somebody yes, had to take Bill. over, so it just became okay. stick drawings. <laughs> so, yeah, we finished case one. Hooray! Uh, you, can see the, you can see the rest if you yeah. play it yourself, but um, now we're going to show... Uh, a pre-alpha version of this game. <sighs> Let me boot it up. Now you um, can see what Lamplight <laughs> City used to look like. Because, yeah, I, yeah, I was actually... Speaking of uh, stick yeah, figures, it yeah, really exactly. will look like the bleach drawings. <laughs> yeah. I, I was actually a beta tester on this game, so I got the opportunity oh. to see this, some early versions and uh, give my feedback on it. Which, I mean, I... Before, yeah. yeah, this was before I had a publisher, so it was only Grunislav games. <laughs> <laughs> Richard Lode Shardlat. Uh, how's the volume now? Uh, I hope it'll be the same as it was before. Oh god, look at that old font. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, please hold yeah. it. So, There's no voices. <laughs> you don't have to adjust the voice volume. Yeah. There's really no voice <laughs> in this version. I don't think, anyway. So, let's see oh. what the start of the game looked like. There's a version. lot fewer pedestrians in the street. So how badly would it explode if you tried to load a, a newer save, do you reckon? <laughs> oh, it would just crash. Uh, oh, no, we should put that to the test. Yeah. <laughs> the old fonts and the old sprites, look at that one. They were still 320 by 200 size sprites scaled up to 640 by 400. I'll admit that took me a second to figure out via the Discord. No, yeah, you'll you'll probably see it in the larger. No. Is, is that using that hack to get a higher res font? No. Oh no, of course that went away, didn't it? it yeah. Patched out. Yeah. The things I'm half remembering from widget eye commentaries of years mm. gone by. <laughs> The conversation here is also a bit different, of course. Yeah, it didn't change that much. I think I just... Um, yeah. You cut a bit. Otherwise, this is pretty much exactly the same. Have to get back? Well, they'll they'll flag one down when they're done. Oh, 
Yeah, that changed a lot too. Come on, Bill. This looks pretty similar. Yeah, all the backgrounds are the same. Yeah. It's just the character sprites that have changed. They look like Lego men. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Um. <clears throat> is there anything specific uh, we could else show off in this version, or is that? Uh, it? If it's in debug mode, you can probably. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's go to. Um... Oh, you're gonna have to go through this. I think this is the old version of Mrs. Handbrook too, where she was. Oh yeah, look at that. <laughs> She's a lot scarier looking there too. Um. Oh, look at that font. Oh god, the font's terrible. Go back to the, uh... I think... I don't think I had added the option to go back to the desk or the main menu at this point, but... Oh, you can look at the case book. No! Oh. <laughs> that was the old oh. case book with the, uh, well, wow. the placeholder case book. Which is terrible. Um, if you go back to the desktop, you can probably go to the secret case skip menu. Oh, cool. I did add that in. Quit to So, title. quit to title? Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> He's saying it's all in the menu. Oh, no. It's froze the game. Okay, maybe it didn't freeze the game. Good. All right, so if you do control C. Control C? Yep. Oh, yeah. Huh. Now you can go to I never see if case that. 5 exists yet. <laughs> No, it doesn't. Go to case. Go to case. Try, try go to going to case three. Let's say. I'm sure there's probably going to be a lot of placeholder stuff at this point. Yeah. <laughs> yep. There you go. <laughs> Looks pretty placeholder to me. Yep. Yeah. Really. <clears throat> <laughs> Shadowy figure. Yeah, you can just skip through all this, because that'll be spoilers for anyone who didn't play. Blah, 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 blah. Oh! Yep, there we go. Same bedroom, just lower res miles sprite. It is very much lower res, yeah. It's, yep. it's a big difference. And that means Adelaide's going to be lower res too outside. And I don't think I had double click there at that point. Oh my god, look at her hair! <laughs> it's huge! It's much poofier! It is! Oh, this is probably Addie when she was still... Yeah, uh, Addie was very different looking as well, too. Yeah. Um, but if you go to the... Uh, if you get the newspaper and the telegram and go to the crime scene, it's probably going to be placeholder as well. Ooh. In fact, you'll probably see some placeholder sprites. Ooh. Oh, and this was still when Upton was sending telegrams instead of handwritten notes. Okay, let's see what this looks like now. I wonder if the map is in here. Yeah, it is. Okay. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Police officers. Oh. From <laughs> nice. And I think, uh, yeah, these are all <laughs> other golden wigs, right? No walking animation. <laughs> yeah, no, it's gliding animation. <laughs> Yep, this is what this is what adventure games look like for like ninety percent of the development process. At least you... uh, in your process. Well, yeah, in my process for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Bye now. <laughs> Woo. <laughs> so yeah, oh, these are probably place park seven. edition. These are definitely placeholder portraits too, so if you talk to these guys, they're gonna they're gonna look interesting. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> what is that? I don't know. I looked, I looked up. Uh, I think I just looked up police outfit or something or police costume, and I got yeah. a sexy police costume, and I was like, "Fuck it, I'll put this in." I oh, that's what I was going to ask. Yeah. yeah. The just other one I step think. Music slab now. Wow. Thanks, man. <clears throat> good. I think uh, the the one on the left is probably I, I forget what he looks like or what his placeholder was. I think it was just some like kid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what? Wow. Is this a Doogie Howser spinoff? What's going on? <laughs> oh. Yeah, no. He was supposed oh. to be like the young rookie. They're complete cop. with the watermark too. Yeah, he's got watermark. Of course, I mean it's placeholder. Right? Almost looks like Barney oh. Stinson. It does look like. Yeah. Also, Miles has a weird thing on the side of his left, uh, of his left eye, where I didn't shade it in, so he has like this weird bump-looking thing. Uh, the other eye. Yeah, his left. Yeah, on the corner. Oh, here, there. right? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Oh uh, yeah. Well. Anyway, yeah, look. that's basically <laughs> what these things look like. I'm curious to see what the if you look at the red thing and you go to the supper club, what the uh, what the supper club is going to look like. This is actually a fun little trip down memory lane. <laughs> Good that I kept the old version then. Yeah. Oh look, it's the shard light icon. Ah! Oh wait, what? is this? This is great. Talk to the lady. Talk to the lady. I want to oh, see her. That's the shard light icon. Yeah, it's the <laughs> map icon. For, one of the map icons from shard light. Nice. I still have yet to play shard light, even though I bought it Ooh. when it first came out. Yeah, I never. Oh, you should. Yeah, it's I good. I played the demo, but then I never got around to playing the full game. So yeah. Oh. <laughs> I remember her. Yeah. Okay. That's not what she looks like in the end, but that's yeah. That's it's actually it's funny because that's that like one of Mary those... I don't know. I don't know. I just I to the effort to cut out the background of this uh, placeholder art. Well, I mean, I wanted to be, I wanted it to be consistent. But uh, yeah, the fun part of of the placeholder process is just finding portraits. At least if you're doing portraits for for you know what you want them to kind of look like. Um, <laughs> so it was just like you know, older lady who's been drinking and is obviously wealthy. So I was just on that <laughs> yeah, on Google image. It. I was like, all right, that's what's going in. Perfect. So yeah, because originally I just had the same portrait for all the placeholders, but that got really confusing. So I decided to put the put it in Google image stuff. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, yeah, so anyway, I hope you've enjoyed uh, this look at both the released version of Lamplight City and this uh, old pre-alpha version. But um, we're going to do a quick um, raffle for a Lamplight City key on Steam right now. So uh, for anyone who wants a shot at winning uh, the Lamplight City Steam key, uh, please write dot uh no not dot exclamation mark raffle in chat and then i'll keep track of who's entered and i'll do a random number generation to see who the winner is um anyway uh francisco gonzalez also known as grandislav i really want to thank you for joining me and the rest of the gang for look at this game uh, it's been a really fun time yeah it was my pleasure and thanks for streaming it i appreciate any anyone who streams and anyone who gets the word out yeah well Yay. i personally really wanted to show this game off well the two games i really wanted to uh include in this marathon were lamplight city and unavowed and since someone else picked unavowed i thought well i'll pick lamplight city <laughs> <laughs> Oh well, yeah, it's. I think it's a great game, and I really enjoyed uh, helping slightly in the beta testing process. And uh, it's. Uh, I've enjoyed all your previous work, and I thought this was just a great uh, follow-up in your. Uh, well, I wouldn't say it's serious since they're not all in the same setting and stuff. But all your games have like similar themes and gameplay, and um, just 
they're great detective stories and such, and I, I really enjoy that genre. So well, thank you. I, I hope uh, you enjoy my next game, <laughs> which is not a detective story. <laughs> I'm sure I'll in, still enjoy it uh, as long as it's a point and click adventure game. <laughs> oh, of course. I'm just kidding. Uh, but uh, I don't know how to do anything else. <laughs> Well, somebody might not have to bother with the random number generator. We've only oh. had one entry. <laughs> ah. Uh, what What was a? Uh, we can do the question you thought of for my other thing. Um, if you, uh, yeah, I had an sure idea what's... of uh, doing the same thing as we did uh, for the previous one, where we ask a question and the best response uh, gets the key. Uh, but if we're yeah, pressed for time. Yeah, that's uh, that's, yeah. that's a bit of we're a bit time pressed for that indeed. Uh, and also, I feel personally, I do like the concept, but I feel like that's a, a little less fair towards all the person who uh, people who enter the giveaway. So, uh, has really only one person answered? Uh, well, when there's only one candidate, there's only one choice. So, so. who who was it? Because I actually actually missed it in chat. Got Grog. Right? Got grog. There you go. Perfect. So, uh, so there, there's there's, Hi, there's the one person in the raffle uh, list, and uh, well, um, yeah. So is this the part where you run a random number generator for <laughs> one? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and it still doesn't pick him. <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess the, the key will go to got grog then. Um, Hooray! Um, I'll send it right to you your way in a few minutes. Um, anyway, thank you very much once again, uh, Grintislav, for joining us. And thank you all so mu much for uh, both uh, tuning in during my stream and uh, sticking around during the entire event in general. So please uh, do keep watching as we are going to switch to uh, Alexander Mejia from Human Interact streaming um, his own game he just released, Starship Commander, which, which is a yep. VR adventure game. So yeah. don't leave. He'll be right back as I stop streaming. All Bye. right. Are you, are you done with